What is it? MSRA, Mr. MSRA. Oh my God, we can't get an intro. Let's let it go. Let's let it go. Let's let it start. Hey, what's up, guys? Thomas, Dope as Usual, whatever you want to call me. Welcome back to the Dope as Usual podcast. This is my co host, Marty O'Neill. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. (laughs) (laughs) So we're trying to start. It's the second intro we're trying to start. It's ASMR. As Mr., remember? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, not ANG. Or AARP, whatever this was. AMG. Yo, what's up, guys? Uh, Welcome back. Sorry, sorry for this intro. Welcome back, guys. Today's our guest is OG. All right, we're trying that. to do this intro we're for seven this minutes. Intro. Hi, hi. New glasses. Oh, no, really? Fresh. What do you mean? Oh, these really? Are not, these are not new. New. You don't wear those glasses. Oh, new to ever. this show. No, new to life. Fool, you don't wear those. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I do. Uh, you can tell the difference between these. Oh, oh looks. of course. Really? Those are yeah. way square on the top. They almost look like these Chanel ones I saw. That's why I noticed it right off the bat. Right. Don't be lying. The fool right. sent me to Chola Land the other day. Oh, yeah. For what? I did send him to Chola Land. For the TED Talk clothes. I'm like, yo, I need a. I, yo, I called him, like, I need a pro club shirt. And he went, oh, nice. <laughs> finally. <laughs> like, nah, I need it for an undershirt. <laughs> and he goes, go to Cholo Land. I go, that's not a store. No, that's not a store. Fool, give me an address. It's by Target. Which one? You know. In Cholo Land. By Cholo Land. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Did so you end up going? I, this is this is from there. Oh shit! <laughs> right. I bought this there. Oh shit! Damn, that's like a corner store of thermal. It's exactly. Like I've never worn thermal in my life. I like it. Oh shit! Yeah, yeah. Actually, you're lucky you didn't wear that shit last night. I right? almost did. I almost did. Hey man, you're thanks for coming nice. back on the show on such such short notice. Yeah. And yeah, he's sober it. now, guys. He doesn't drink a drop of liquor at all until he picks up his cup again. He will <laughs> not be sober anymore. This fool's drunk. All right. He I didn't see. drive here. You're gonna get shit faced today. Uh, no, actually, I did drive it, here. It's diluted, and so he can't. You can't get drunk can't off get it if it's diluted. <laughs> that's true. Right? Yo, mm-hmm. oh, that's the first question I want to start with. What did we talk about last night during the TED Talk? Oh, a TED Talk. So while you're talking about how successful... That's not it. You were. You that's are. Not <laughs> that's not it. Now, um, let's see. I don't know. Um, you know what? Tell you the truth. This is what I was going to tell you. I think they lowered the mic on you guys, bro. Because everybody else was so fucking loud. Mm-hmm. And when it came to you guys, I was like, what the fuck? Like, if they just turned it down a little notch, bro. Really? Did you, did you honestly, did you see I that? I couldn't or no? hear the speakers towards you guys. Well, yeah, because I, I recorded other people when they were talking They're and then that shit was loud. And then you guys came up and mm-hmm. it was like kind of low. I was like, what the fuck? It's a good excuse. Yeah. And then they put you guys at the end, too. I was just like, fuck, bro. I was kind of like, I think everybody was pissed off. Yeah. And, and it did good. It uh, did yeah, good. it did. It did. It was a good show. Mm-hmm. Yep, for sure. Yeah. That's what we talk about. Uh-huh. Well, we will talk about how he used to hustle before and how he, you know, went to jet, didn't want to hustle no more, and, you know. Oh, he yeah. listened. Yeah. Uh, me and Marty sure. were like, let's, let's have him break down the what thesis. we talked about. Uh-huh. Yeah, no, for sure. And then Marty Ray came out as a host after. I oh, know, uh-huh. right? What the fuck? Everybody was pissed because he's out. He comes out as a host. We he's going to call you out, and he calls someone else. And he was like, that's fucking disrespectful. <laughs> Fuck that. <laughs> Fucking more. That's disrespectful. Well, like he was that. being the MC at TED Talk for a little bit. Uh-huh. And everybody thought it was our turn. They're like, oh, on the spot. Oh, you're just MCing. Yeah. Okay. All right. We'll wait for you guys. Nothing wrong. It was just, it just kept, it kept getting pushed back. And that's all. Yeah. 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 That shit right. was cool, though. Yeah, it was cool. I found out moments before the host had to dip out. So they were like, hey, can you? It got, TED Talk was a little late. He dipped out or he just. The host had to leave because at a certain time he was done. Well, damn, the motherfucker was talking like motherfucking a whole hour in between each fucking. I don't know. And I was like, damn, bro, is this the, I'm all like, is this a TED talk or is he just, <laughs> you know, so. I missed the whole thing. I was in the back studying my notes and then, and then I, I, know, I forgot. Uh-huh. <laughs> that was pretty much it. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty. All right. All right. Cool. Cool. Can we hit this fool with where you at right off the bat? Yeah. Uh, can we do that real quick? Uh-huh. You got it. Right? Can you run it? Where, uh, you where I'm at? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a segment we like to call where you at. And Marty's going to ask you two things, and that's it. You say, where are you at with it? That's it. How, where am I? Where, how a, do I feel about segment. this? Did we already do the uh, the 16-year-old version with OG? Oh, let's do that first. OG, I have a question. I ask people. I like to ask certain guests this question. I don't think I asked you. Yeah. If 16-year-old you walks in the door, are you going to beat the dog shit out of him, or are you going to fuck you up? 
The 16 year old me walked in the door. Walks in the door, and you guys got to fight. Are you going to win or do you lose? You know what? A- um, after that cup. 16 oh, year old me, I would probably no say. No guns involved. You know, nah, that's a, that was a little loose cannon, dude. Probably. I probably, uh, no, probably wouldn't be able to. The old man strength doesn't outweigh that, though? Oh, well, actually, yeah, but, you know, back then, I mean, I don't know. It was a little more different. I was a little more aggressive. Did you ever have a stretch where you were, like, lifting and shit, working out heavy? Uh, you know what? Um, nah, not too much. If I, if I do work out and shit, like, say, in a year, if I do work out, I'm going to work out maybe twice, maybe two months. Out of the whole the whole year, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> you don't hear that a lot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know what I mean? Shit, I don't fucking... I don't oh, we got, got 60 days a year. You know what I mean? Shit. Yeah, you know, that's realistic. I mean, it's the truth. I mean, shit, I work like about maybe sometimes 12 hours a day. You would do those 10 hours workouts. a day, 12 Damn. hours, 13 hours. So, you know what I mean? So, fuck. so you go in there at 9 and you're in there until fucking 9. Yeah. Damn. For sure. I mean, don't get me wrong. I'm doing, you know, I'll do push ups in my office. All That's the time. what he told me the other day. I just did 100 push ups. Like, yeah. That counts. Right, fool. 100 yeah. push ups. No, yeah, in, a, in, a, in right. a whole day of my work, maybe I, I could bust about maybe 250 push ups. Uh huh. For sure. That's a lot. It's just funny That's to enough. see. I mean, it's, it's uh, weed shops and push-ups in the back, <laughs> staring at the cameras. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Man, yeah. That's literally a good fun footage. Camera, camera, burn a right. piece watching the cameras. <laughs> hey, hilarious. fire. Fire that girl. That's this fool in the intercom. <laughs> Fucking. You know what this fool does? Instead of politely intercoming, hey, um, Melissa, can you come in the back? He does this. And smacks his wall <laughs> until somebody hears him on the other side, and then they show in up in that big ass building that's yes. loud as shit with music. No, usually I buzz the door. No, besides that, I've <laughs> seen you just hear do this. The buzz, they know, they, you know they, I'm calling him. You but do yeah, this you know. until that girl with the tattoo shows up. <laughs> You're a jerk, fool. <laughs> <laughs> he answered the phone this morning. Goes, all right, no, call her in. Call her in. I, I want to fire her. That's what I heard when yeah. I answered the phone today. I don't know what it is about some weed shops, but they just constantly go through. You, just you know what it is? It's, 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 it's this new comes. generation. This new generation, bro. Is there something else, bro? You, know what what I mean? you heard the TED Talk? They, they, they seem like, I mean, work is like. You got a joint? You like that? Something, up? It's something else to them. You know what I mean? Uh-huh. Yo, yo, yo. It's, it's not the same. You thank know what I mean? Thank like, you. Thank you. You would think people would be motivated, or be you know, uh-huh. happy to get more hours to work. And it's like, nah, they're just. The less hours, if you send them home, they're like happy. It's not like fucking, you know what I mean? Like, really? I want to stay. I want to work. No. Thank God. How many people with good work ethics have come through that you're like, damn, this motherfucker's a beast? Uh, Well, it depends because, you know, I have three different departments. You know, I have a trim department. Uh, there's a growth department. And then I have my retail. So, I mean, um, yeah, sometimes I do. I get good. I get a lot of good uh, trimmers that are, you know, pretty good. Stick around a long time. <laughs> got good worth, got work ethics. Wow, well, yeah, they got good. <laughs> and I trip out, so I'm like, oh shit, you know, where'd this guy come from? You know what I mean? Shit's pretty fast. Where you been all quick. my life? You know what I mean? Um, <laughs> same thing, you know, I, I have a few bud tenders that are, you know, they commit and shit, but for the foremost, nah. They, how they're, they're how many people are getting canned a quarter? 20. Oh, every, oh, fuck, no, I'm constantly, we're always firing people, dude. I mean, shit. I mean, like I said, people want to just come in. Do what they want to do, and they're just like, bam. And it's like it's different now. People got like this attitude and shit. Like you know, like <laughs> fuck, bro. It's like everything's changing now. Like and you shit. work for them and shit. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, exactly. You know what I mean? Like I, I just hired a guy. I mean, just what this week, and uh, they told me, "Oh, you're doing, oh no, I don't want to do that." He's like, "I'm not gonna be here that long." I go, "Dude, you just got hired. It's your first day. What do you mean? You don't want to fucking do that? You're, you're not gonna be here that long." I'm like, "Fuck, you're fucking right." So now nah, the next day you're gone, bro. You're not gonna be here the second day, you know. So I, when I caught wind of them, I'm like, "Nah, you don't even come the second day. Get them out of here." Who had the button? Was it Monty Burns? Mm, that drops him in your office in the next level. Remember on The Simpsons, Mr. Burns, they bring people in the office. He goes, "You're fired," and he'd hit the button. And they'd fall into the dungeon. Oh, yeah. You need shit, one of those. I wish I had one of those. One of those a slide and it shoots him to the front door. Oh, yeah, yeah, that, shit, <laughs> that, that would be shit. Great. That would be great for sure. That would be great. Hey, you ever seen this movie, Babes in Toyland? With Keanu Reeves? No, no. What is it? Babes in Toyland? No. What the fuck? When so, did that come out? Fuck, like 1984, probably. Oh shit! When did it come out? <clears throat> Shereen, when did it come out? 83? She oh, isn't there. I'm all dead. You know the year. Yeah. I'm like, damn, what year was she born? A little after that. 
All right. So anyway, there's one of those little dungeons. I saw that joint. That shit almost hit you in the face. I almost hit it. Yeah, I saw that. That shit last night smelled like tangerines. Yeah, whatever you rolled. Oh, the the tangy he brought. Wait, no, no. It was runs. Yeah. Oh, that shit smoked good. Dude, I was actually shocked when when I took off. I had one joint left of the same one that I gave him. And I'm smoking. I'm just like, what the fuck? I'm all looking like, what did I label it as? That's what he was doing. And I, was I like, even looked at it like, what is it? Yeah, yeah. I was doing the same thing. And then I, I'm, I'm, I'm like, hey, what is that? Did I write a little initials on that? She goes, no. And I go, well, damn. And I guess that's the fucking runs. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. That shit was fucking fire. Man. Dude, I wasn't sm- I didn't take dabs the whole week before this TED Talk last last night. Guys, for everybody out there, guys, last night we did the TED Talk, right? Excuse me. Fucking. Yeah. Air horns. There you go. Air horns. You don't hear the er, 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 if you had those headphones <laughs> yeah, on. You it. did not. I did. It. Thank you, everybody that came out to TED Talk. It was fucking yes. amazing. Thank you. And if we saw you before we went on, I'm sorry. I was. Uh, I said hi to everybody, but I felt like I couldn't get, get in full conversation. Most of the time, did it, jerk. I, I seen you tr- ignoring people. Oh please. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I was in the corner just pacing, talking to myself, looking like we I'm weren't backstage. Crazy. We were like in I the seen co- you pacing venue. back and forth and. Yeah, I was so trying to top, remember my speech. He kept yeah. bumping into fans and they'd be like, <gasps> like not expecting to come around the corner and see him. And they were just like, it would happen a couple times. People had to catch their fucking breath. That kid almost fainted. Yeah. yeah. Dude, what about that building though? That haunted. building was something else. Bro. Haunted. Yeah. They, do some, demonic, they do some wild shit in demonic there. Demonic <laughs> ass <laughs> statues on the wall. I didn't even want Did to look at it. you see the little faces? Oh, I saw you see it. see the little fucking oh, dwarfs, like little it. elves and Can shit? Can I get the uh, yeah. lighter? That's some fucking... That's these, some, these, the old theaters in Hollywood got... Uh, some vibes. Uh, I don't they do like. Some did you go to the bathroom? In LA. Did you go to the bathroom? Yeah, it's like a New York subway down there. <laughs> I did not. J- Jay, you go to the bathroom? Uh, uh-uh. uh, no thanks. Yeah, that shit was. It was just else. like the theater we saw Atmosphere at, basically. Exactly, it was across the street. Oh, it was yeah, oh, Atmosphere was across the street. Yeah, yeah. Sure. yeah. Um, I definitely got a better vibe from that spot. Oh was yeah, I was, that I place. Feel, was... I could just literally feel the Mm-mm. fucking darkness. Yeah, mm-hmm. I didn't like it at all. Fucking darkness. especially those yeah. rooms at the top of the stairs that had an open door. Did you think there was theater seats in there? So someone does like a single person play. Oh, in there. you know, dude, the the the, the dude that was with the light and shit. Yeah, that man lives there. What? Yeah, what? he lives there, bro. He got his own spot in there. Everything. He oh, OG's there. OG's making it up. I can tell. No, by that look no, actually, <laughs> no, it's right here. He has a tell. Let's go. Well, you can't get me, bro. Well, yeah, his mustache. Check it like out. He walked out. He walked out and came back like with a regular type of cup, like a house cup. And I was like, "Where'd this fool go?" <laughs> but he went up to the top and came back like with a house cup. So I was like, oh, shit. There's apartments so, above it, though. Well, oh, really? Yeah. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. Well, that I did not know. Yeah, but I did see him come yeah. back with a house cup. A and then I did see him come. Like, if he was coming, like, if he was at his pad, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, he had house shoes. So I was all like, dude, this motherfucker lives here or what? You know what I mean? And, I mean, it looked like it did because, I mean, shit. Like yeah. Last Action Hero? Uh, like that old man that just stays at the theater all day? More like the Die Hard, the dude that lives in the airport or in the fucking, you know? Like Brad Pitt and Fight Club. You know, you know the dude that fucking... <laughs> The janitor that <laughs> lives there actually, he has a little spot. He lives inside uh, the airport. You ready? I've only seen Die Hard one. Fuck! I know I've movie pool. I never watched it. I've never seen the other ones. Yeah. I think I've seen Die Hard four. After the four, after the fourth or third, it fourth gets one. Stupid. I've seen first and fourth only. I fourth think the last one with Samuel L. Jackson. That's the last one. That's probably the best. That's it. I don't that's remember. That's fucked up. That's hey, ready? We never asked this fool. What's your favorite top three movies ever? Oh, yeah, rub shit. your whole oh, body. Damn, did, you guys, hey, did you guys feel that shit? No, we can hear it. We can what hear. Stop! Okay, stop! Hey, stop! Stop! Oh, so it sounds it. horrible. Stop! <laughs> Fools are driving doing this right now. <laughs> what is that called? AM Mister? As <laughs> Mister? <laughs> they like that shit. People like that shit. Bro. It's They're his like, trademark shit. They must have said, "Oh, that shit felt relaxing." Uh, <laughs> yeah, emoji. Do it again, hey, homie. See if you had your, your shit. You would hear it deep in your in your head. What's your top three favorite movies? Uh well, I'm the real. Say, don't say something stupid. I know uh, once the know patriot. What? I mean, I, I, I like casino. Fucking, you know, I like the old school movies. Um, um, one, I like fucking from the eighties. I want to say fucking uh, bad boys with Sean Penn. Sean Penn and uh, uh, what's his face? La Bamba's brother. Uh, Lou Diamond Phillips' brother. Yeah, yeah. Ralph, that. what's his full name? East Morales. What? Eastside Morales. Eastside Morales. Ooh, damn, bro. Shit. Yeah, I already <laughs> knew. Sick, That's a good movie. Yeah. Actually, when we're done, I have hella sodas to beat you with. Yeah. I'm going to fuck you up. Yeah. That one, uh, you know, fuck, I just like gangster movies, bro, you know? Um, mm-hmm. Shit, there's a lot of them. There's not just three, my three top movies, because fuck, I really don't have three top movies. I got like fucking. Top well, every five time you movies. talk about movies, uh, well, what are your favorite movies? Go. Shit. Uh, shit, let's see. Um, 
Casino, <laughs> fucking Heat, fucking... Um, it's the Robert De Niro shit? Yeah, yeah I like 80s. a lot of Robert De Niro shit, you mm-hmm. know what I mean? Uh, I like a lot You're of You ever Cape Fear? Yeah, Robert Cape Fear is also that's pretty a good. good. One. That's a good he one, He could do too. pull-ups, I can't do pull-ups. Yeah, that's a good one. I sh- you know, series también, you know, fucking uh, Sopranos and... Shit like that. Breaking Bad. I still fucking watch Breaking Bad here and there. I go back to certain episodes. That's worth it. It's a good show. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah fuck yeah. Especially that when shit you're high good. as shit. You're like, oh shit. Mm-hmm. When you're high as shit, you be like, oh shit. Fucking moment when he does this shit. That was one of the main shows that I was just like, couldn't believe every time it kept going. I was and it like, kept getting better. How the fuck is he going to get it out never of got cheesy, every time? Right? This motherfucker was a nut, huh? And like, there's nobody that's ever transformed that much within a show, I feel like. From like, dad... To fucking psychopath and Well, I mean, wife. you gotta think about it. The dude's about to exit life, so I mean, yeah. shit. I mean, if you really think about it, fuck. I mean, what? Do, I mean, mm-hmm. if you know you're about to die, you're gonna die, so you have so much time. I mean, fuck. Who? Mm-hmm. Best thing to do is fuck. Take care of the motherfuckers that you want to fucking <laughs> that you didn't like. <laughs> <laughs> I let you to say the people around you <laughs> take care of your family. Oh, that was a, <laughs> that was a big twist. twist. Hey, actually, hold on. Eat those. Bro, I eat fucking one. Eat drank. one. Eat one. No. One, no, one no, shark? Bro. You're going to get me fucking crossfaded with this one shit, One shark. I those are the placebo ones. Fucking the five hours yeah, shit. those are I the placebo. two of them. He got... No. He was in... No, stop. Let me tell the story. Stop. <laughs> Let me set the scene. Nah, this fool is not... Is, this fool has a home, multiple cars, a backyard, a front yard, a garage, a couch. A dad. A dad. I call him. What are you doing? So I'm on my lawn. I'm like, all right, cool. In your in your car? Yeah. Bottle of wine. Full chugging wine, hot box in his car, and just on his <laughs> in his front yard. Two in the morning. I'm like, all right, that's cool. Then he pulls out the whole bottle of wine. I'm like, Where's Mindy? You just hear a laugh. And then the <laughs> joint comes back into the FaceTime. That's it. Then he goes, all right, I'll try you for you little shots. They're not going to do nothing. Mm. He chugged two of them. We're on the phone for 30 minutes, and this fool started, I don't know. What I, was, I never had some shit like that before in my life. That's pretty much what he was doing. And then the next morning, we are supposed to go on a drive, and I go, you're not calling me. You're not calling me by one. I was I'll give you till three. You're not calling me. You call me at five o'clock. No, actually, I had to wake up the next morning and take my daughter to work. And it was like, uh, yeah, and then you said I came home, and was I was it fucked Christmas up. Christmas holidays or Thanksgiving holidays, right? Thanksgiving. And uh, so, fuck, bro, I had to wake up the next day. Uh, like, So I'm talking to him like at 2 in the morning, maybe, one thirty. right? Yeah. And I chug those two things. All of a sudden, I get waking up by my daughter at like 7 in the morning, 6.30 in the morning or something like that. Like, you need to take me to work. Come on, let's go. And I'm just, mm-hmm. bro, I get up and I'm like, fuck, bro. I'm literally driving and I'm like. Feel dizzy almost. I'm, huh? I'm, I'm thinking to myself because I forget. I forgot that I had taken a shit. Two shots. So, so I'm thinking I go. No, you drink two, sh- two oh, shots. Okay, okay. I two took, full syrups. All right. Yeah, two full syrups. You know what I mean? So I'm thinking to myself, while I'm driving, you know, I'm, I'm thinking like, fuck, man, you know what? I need to go to the, I need to go to the doctor and get checked, bro. I go, I'm fucking, <laughs> I go, this is not normal, bro. I go, I'm a fucking. You feel like your brain's I go, moving I feel a like bit. I'm fucking, like, I'm what, still a dream. Yep. I'm like, I'm not here or what, bro. I go, there's something wrong with me. You forgot, I, you I drop her off. I go back to the bed, and now I can't sleep. Now I'm like, fuck. So I'm, I'm hungover, and I'm like, you know what? Fuck this. I go to the store and I grab me a beer. I'm not an alcoholic, bro. <laughs> Two minutes before we start. <laughs> Dude. So did that work? I mean, bro, it got me more like more fucking weird. Yeah, it's fucked a beer. So I'm like, I'm, I'm, no, I'm, I'm, like, more fucked I'm like, damn, bro, I'm tripping. I'm tripping. <laughs> so you know what I mean? So next thing you know, I drink a beer and I was like, wow, I'm drunk. Yeah. So now I'm, you're high and drunk. Yeah. You so now, you're no, yeah, now I'm high and I'm drunk again because, you know, I'm like, fuck, you know, the. The alcohol kicks in now. Yeah. You know, and I only had I, shit. No, don't get me wrong. Not with just one beer, but like maybe already like I'm already like at my six pack and I call this phone. I'm like, hey man, what the fuck? Next thing I go, I still feel fucking high. I go, that's when I remember, like, oh, this is what I did. So I think you know I when I was in my car, I think I, I looked at my my daughter's all like, Oh, what's this? You know, they're all empty a little Oh shit. And I'm like, Oh shit. <laughs> I go, now I know what the fuck. Come mm. on. I'm, I'm over here thinking I gotta go to the doctor fucking yeah. Monday morning. Did it I'm hit? Like, was oh, it do- a me. delayed hit? Like, oh no, it. hell no, bro. I mean I, I was on the phone up, with him. Mm-hmm. I was crashing in the walls. Like, you know, when I was when I oh shit, I'm gonna take you to work. I'm gonna hitting walls. Oh there. yeah. And I'm like, fuck, you know. You I mean? didn't get to really sleep it off is the problem. Uh oh hell no, you yeah. can't I don't think you can sleep that. I don't think you can, man. Because dude. When I did the challenge, I drank three. 
Oh yeah, no. It's and shit. I woke up when I woke up. I called our partner Claudia and goes, "Yo, we gotta retest everything. We mm -hmm. gotta redo everything. <laughs> I don't feel as good. I feel I don't feel safe. I'm so fucked up. We gotta retest." us, Thomas. You think we didn't do all this before we even fucking packaged? I'm like, yeah, I know we did, <laughs> but can we retest? Like, dude, it's the HHCP, and I go, oh yeah, yeah. they're HHCP inside. Yeah. It's 30 times stronger than yeah. our normal edible. Three is a lot. It's fucking three. It's yeah. 90 times. I drank two I on the gone, elevator dude. doors just after that second Done. one. Done. Yeah. The syrups are another it's thing. It's actually, what, uh, 72 hours, bro? I mean, I believe. That's it's, when it takes I take a while that, to get, a, get it out of your system. Yeah, I mean, you I feel took, like I took some, and shit. I took some RSO not that long ago, about maybe two, three weeks ago. And, you know, I gave some to a couple of coworkers, too. Everybody was like, what the fuck did you give me? The the, everybody was like, I feel weird. And, you know, the next day, because I go, well, yeah, I, I, you know, it's a, to me, the, the dose that I give you, it's going to be a 72, 73 hour, 74 hour high, bro. It's going to be three days. What is it? Do you eat sure. it? RSO. RSO. But don't, I'm saying like. No. Rick, I, it's hash oil. You can eat it. You can hash eat it. Hash oil. You okay. dab it if you yeah, want. It's disgusting. I'm saying you, in this instance, you ate it. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Mm -hmm. You know, I've, I mean, I've made it and I made it with like, you're supposed to make it just with all the plant matter and shit, but I made it with actual nugs. You know what I mean? So this shit is fucking potent. We're like, I've taken some and um, I literally fucking my legs been numb. Like I can't even get out the car. I literally have to pick my leg up, <laughs> bam, pick my other leg up. And Wolf I'm like, Wall fucking, Street. Yeah, bro, had that. Remember, fucking, yeah, remember the RSO story where he said, take a little bit, fill it up. I didn't mean fill it up. <laughs> and then I got the spins. I threw up everywhere. I was high. I woke up the next day spinning still high. Yeah. It is. It's something. No. Oh, but you know what? It, I think that shit literally fixes you, bro. It fixes you. Hey, yeah, if you want to research RSO, you go on Google and research yourself. We're not going to be pushing that, you know, RSO saves people because we might get our whole fucking existence on YouTube just yeah. deleted <laughs> for that. Nah, because I mean, shit, you will. I mean, it's all over. I mean, it's yeah, I know. Just go look. Google RSO, Rick Simpson Oil. If you Coincidentally, want to know you felt and I mean, better I mean, afterwards. What was that? Coincidentally, Coincidentally I felt better. Yeah. You felt better in some well, way. Well, no, it always does. It like it resets you. It resets mm. your body. It's like a mushroom does. trip. You know what I mean? So oh, like, okay. say if right now, whatever you, you fucking, you're a little off and shit, your fucking balance is a little off. I guarantee you, you take half of a syringe of some RSO, half a gram. And four days later, after you come back, yeah, you'll be all right. Yeah, oh, three shit. days later, you know, it's, like it's, it's going like to reset that, you and you're going to feel good about yourself. It, like, you just feel good. Yeah. Everything, even it's like fucking that. it. Like it I'm, I'm going to say this right now. I gave this one girl some and... um it was actually, uh, it was actually one. Actually, you know what? It was my cousin, and my and my and my other and my other uh, brother. You know, rest in peace. I gave him some, and they both came at me with the both the same. You know, they go, hey, you know what? When I couldn't sleep, I was having like these crazy, like fucking, like like nightmares that were like evil, like bad shit, like you know, like like something bad. And I'm like, what the fuck? So my 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 brother first told me that like yeah dude, I was on the couch and I was like having like some weird scary shit where like I've never felt that I was all oh, trip out <laughs> and then all of a sudden and I was like oh trip out <laughs> no, I, I was just thinking trip That's out because Mexican I mean shit, I, I felt that shit myself that. too yeah. I have trip felt out, that shit bro. myself but I mean my thing is that I I I, I thought it was just me you know <sighs> I'm fucking okay Sorry, my shit going on yeah, yeah. my head fucking that's probably what happens cool nah the my other my other um. My other uh, homegirl came too, and she's just like, nah, man, that shit fucking like took the demons out of me. Oh. And I was like, what the fuck? Like, I go, wait a minute. I go, that's, that's fucking crazy because, you know, my fucking, my, you know, my brother Snuffy just told me the same thing too. You know what I mean? He told mm -hmm. me like some fucking like evil shit was like coming in and out of him. And I was like, oh, fuck. You know, then I think, it, I think honestly, it, it, it really works like that wherever this fucking shit comes from because I mean, it's, like, really, it's like a mushroom trip yeah well it, yeah, gets, it goes to, into your brain and kind of deals with the shit that's in your head RSO will get you so fucked up mm -hmm. your body's probably like hey deal with the shit in your head because your body's mm -hmm. not gonna do anything right now mm -hmm. you better work on your head to work on your fucking body you know what I mean because yeah. mushrooms do the same shit mm -hmm. for sure yeah mushrooms do the same exact thing it's just like an internal cleansing I mm -hmm. would say so and eat the fucking shark is what I'm trying to say. <laughs> eat a shark, man. This fuck he's trying to get one nah. shark. It's 100 milligrams. Nah. nah it's nah, 100 nah, milligrams. Nah, it's 100 milligrams. Bro. Read it. Yeah, I know. It's 100 <laughs> so, milligrams. Okay, so let's say this. So 100 milligrams, how many milligrams in it would be if it were to be THC? Just uh, more or less, what would you think? 70. Oh, fuck that. 70 milligrams? 70 is what eat I take. half a shark. I, I think take 70 milligrams almost... 
on a daily use. Eat half yeah, a shard. Just to be, you'd take be able a bite to eat of it. Like one bite. Oh, it's right. a new oh, shard. You want me to taste it? Yeah, yeah they're sure. brand new. Look, yeah, yeah. it's a, no, it's I a could sour do that, water. But no, bro, I seen what this shit does to you, bro. I know. <laughs> take a bite. I just want you. It's a new one. A sour watermelon. Oh, bro, I didn't even tell you. Remember those fucking ones? Those um, those gummies we got in Vegas. The hash gummies. No, the mushroom gummies. Did they hit you? Oh, bro, I had fucking forgot that they were fucking. And you ate them? I, I know, I ate, you know, because I, I wasn't going to eat the whole thing because, you know, I'm like, fuck it. I ate half of it. And fuck, bro, I'm fucking, like, I'm going to work and shit. And I'm just like, what the fuck? Did I just see the fucking, <laughs> the light? Like, and I'm like. So you forgot Damn. you ate mushroom gummies and went to work? I didn't, I didn't work. realize it until, like I said, once again, I'm California, over here thinking, man. fuck, I need to go to the fucking <laughs> hospital. Something's wrong with me. You, know you need mean? to keep a diary of the shit Same you shit, bro. I was all thinking, fuck, I gotta go to the hospital, Yo, this man. episode's <laughs> called, I need to fucking go to the doctor. Dude, seriously. I, Something's I was, wrong I was, with me. I thought I was something wrong with me again. And next thing uh, you know, I'm thinking, well, what did I eat? Like, oh, I ate that edible. And I'm thinking, you know, wait a minute. That fucking edible was fucking, they were mushrooms. They weren't fucking. And I'm like, oh, fuck, bro. No. Here, fuck My mom bro. ate the whole entire box and she said she felt nothing. What? Oh, Really? Oh Maybe shit! But was it that? No, same ones, they gave us the same one ones. that was like the grenade. Remember the? I gave her that one too, and then I gave her a bunch of other shit that they gave me. Really? And she said they did nothing to her. I got a whole bag of the the legal mushrooms at my house to try because we want to do the dopest mushrooms, the dopest shrooms, okay. the legal mushrooms, and ship all fifty states. It's fucking great. But if they don't hit you, I ain't fucking no, no. Yeah, yeah. But my mom's like, these ones shit. didn't work. But you're like, damn, those see traces. Well, it, no, no, no. It didn't hit like a normal mushroom. I'll tell you that right now. It didn't. That's I, light. Yeah, it was more like I just kept seeing like little fucking streaks. Mm. And I'm over here thinking about fuck, man, fucking. I hear about this shit. People saying they see little fucking lines. Something's wrong with them. Mm. So I'm like, fuck, something's wrong with me too now. <laughs> but then I realized what I did. Fucking about. It took me about an hour to finally. Just freaking out for an hour, then he goes, Oh, yeah, I ate mushrooms. <laughs> no, nah, no, nah, at the same time, I'm over here thinking, Fuck, I need bro, to be that shit. carefree with I'm, my life, dude. I'm in well, this I fucking, forget that I ate mushrooms and uh -huh. just go to work. <laughs> I'm thinking I'm, this, I'm in this motherfucking it. matrix or some uh -huh. shit, you know? I'm like, He's over here, bro. Oh, I'm yo, the doctor's like, Bro, we gotta we gotta work something out. You can't be calling me like this every day. <laughs> <laughs> so did you eat anything today? Oh. Yeah, sorry, doctor. Oh, no, nah, fuck. No, yeah, yeah, nah. You don't want to try one. You don't want to go to your doctor. They taste like, uh, I think they taste like red Kool-Aid. It's only 100 milligrams, bro. Come on. I'll eat one with you. You could wolf that bag <laughs> down if you felt Fuck like it. Fuck out of here. I eat two with you. You eat one with me. I eat two. <laughs> I eat two right now. Why are you three? I'm looking forward to this video. No. I haven't Actually, gotten to the, the challenge. Good. The but challenge? The, the, this Tuesday's you just video. just throw half of eating shark back in the brand I threw a fucking little shark that got fucking bit by another shark. Minnow, yeah. He just went... <laughs> yeah, so let's get back on the conversation. What a... That's the, your whole no, bag. Actually, it's your it bag. tastes good. It tastes good. They take do. your bag. No, honestly, By the way, I, by the way, you should take one more bite. Take one more bite. No, my Feel ass. Feel a little bit. more bite. Take one more bite. Take one more bite. No, my ass. ass. Shit. <laughs> take a bite of my ass. It's the shit you say sometimes. Also, yeah, the shit's good those are HACP and THC. Yeah, you see, little jerk. <laughs> you know what I mean? So I the know. new Dobe Shop shit, they're Is Delta that, 9 yeah. THC and HHCP and HHC. Those yeah, ones are dead. Well, now he's got to try the gems. It's only I mean, right. Fucking, um. Here you go. I do the same shit. No, nah, hell no. This Boy, is a, com this is a comparison. Me. The smaller this shit is, the more <laughs> fucking dangerous this shit is. I don't know. That's this what guy right said. here. <laughs> Fuck out of here, fool. Come shit. on, it's like the minute black guy. It's like the minute black guy. Yeah, uh, at know, least you open know, it you know, smell it. You know how many people I get and I fuck? I get a lot of people. I get a lot of people to eat fucking at my work and shit. Uh -huh. I fuck with people. No, 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 Marty, no, no, Marty. I fucking give he everybody. He tricks a lot yeah. of people. No, I know what he's say. saying. The two milligrams, bro. They're samples. There's 300 watches. Fucking nah, I asshole, to fucking get bro. people he's switching fucking packaging. He's, he's writing. He's switching numbers on packages <laughs> so he can prank his coworkers, bro. This fool's life. I took some cookies. <laughs> crazy. Like about a few weeks ago. Well, a few months ago. <laughs> We got some cookies from the fucking, some, some company, you know, cookies and shit. So I got them and I fucking seen these other bags. And I'm like, you know what? I took them out of the fucking, out of the packaging. Uh -huh. Put them on some like casual packaging. <laughs> fucking right in the back. I'm like, oh, you know, uh, right now a vendor just brought me these cookies. You guys want any? Oh, fuck. Yeah, I'll take one. <laughs> these don't have no, no, no fucking THC. What'd you do there? I'm like, nah, not at all. Fuck no, bro. <laughs> got them. 
<laughs> you hear this work environment? He's tripping like, out on mushrooms and shit. Oh, just fuck all. no. What is this? A little fucking cherry bomb? Take them apart. It's one. It's two. It's oh, I thought it was two. I thought it, no. it looked like some type of strawberry. They stuck together. No, they're uh, they're uh, high, hell right? no fool shit. Bro, they're CBD and HHC. My ass CBD. The CBD and HHC. He ate it. Eat it. It's two gems. They taste real good. They're though. fucking Those are the bomb. children's ones, yeah. right? Yeah, those are the melatonin <laughs> and CBD ones we got. Oh, you want me to put me asleep? They're mel- oh, yeah, that's right, huh? <laughs> 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 fucking end of the podcast. I'm fucking right here. We'll draw on you. Don't worry. I'll do a laugh now. I'll cry later. <laughs> All right, these are good. They are but good. How are you taking bites? You're taking you just bites of the fuck out. Yeah, he's eating them. He did. <laughs> I'm, I'm fucking testing them. No, take eat they're it. Good. They're actually really good, bro. Right? They're nah. Bro, eat know. one at least. Are you like serious? Candy. They're 15 milligrams. 15 milligrams. Are you kidding me? Let me fucking read this shit. <laughs> he doesn't have his reading glasses on. But trust me, they're 15 <laughs> milligrams. <Yeah. laughs> he pulls out the red lokes. They're bifocal lokes. Like, like, you know. <laughs> Uh, and then it's funny that they don't fucking say how strong they are, right? Yes, they do. They're 15. It says one five per serving. Yeah, well. Eat one. If you don't eat 15 no, milligrams. Hell no, no, I could taste that shit. 15 milligrams. Mm. Yo, your name is OG. Not OG or <laughs> no G. <laughs> you but sweat you're 15 milligrams. Yeah, just what is when you happening? Know, and shit. All right, right. One gummy. Really, 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 really fucking want to see me fucked up, me home. This is the peer pressure. It's, yeah, I love it. People are going to be like, oh, you're peer pressuring him. No, that's this man just talked about fucking dosing people. Don't get mad at me. You ate one? Yeah. Let me I see. Ate. Go on your tongue. Oh, no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Lift your tongue. I, I, I I'll eat it. I ain't tripping. I, 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 I'll, I'll eat it. You got one I'll and a half that whole the bag. Yeah. But the whole bag is two. I don't want to fuck up the show, bro. Are you ready? Those are hash house edibles. Yeah, I know. Yeah, food. those are. Don't f- tell me. I already know. Those are fifty milligrams <laughs> yeah, each, and you're sure done. You the label. You're done. Those are strong. I can't wait. You fucking little jerk. You know what's crazy? He's talking drunk. about this tricking guy. people. <laughs> as he's like, oh, oh, That's eating it. and getting tricked at the same time. No, no, it's all good shit. Fuck, man. It's all good shit. Fuck, <laughs> so man. much shit. Fucking, I, I've eaten mushrooms. Fucking, uh, I'm good. Then eat the other one. Nah, I'm not trying to get all. I don't want to get all hashed out. Because, you know, tomorrow I don't want to fucking fuck my day off in the morning it's when I wake Sunday. up. It's Sunday. You aren't doing <laughs> shit. And the Raiders lost today. Yeah. What the fuck God, do you damn. care? Hold on, real quick. How can the Raiders... Hold on, here we go. Everybody I'm go watch that microphone. fucking touchdown from the <laughs> Chiefs Raiders Oh, game. my God. <laughs> what you oh, doing? my it's demoralizing. God. demoralizing. See what I mean? That was probably the stupidest shit I ever done on the fucking show in my life. You, you saw it? I saw the caption and said, the Chiefs oh. are toying with their food. <laughs> what you doing? I looked around the warehouse right now because I was going to go like this. I was looking for a microphone, something that could be used as a microphone. <laughs> I moved my microphone <laughs> to look for something that I could here, go, hey, here, work. talking to this. I could have just, oh, my fucking. That's like, like me lighting uh, it. Yeah. It's like looking for your yeah. phone while you're on your phone. Yeah, right? yeah. You're using your flashlight <laughs> I've done that phone. shit. Yeah. I'm going to have my phone. I'm like looking for my phone. And I'm like, where's my fucking phone? Yo, I don't know if my, bra- right, my brain is not back yet. People this don't one, understand. We need to address the amount here. of brain power it takes to write a motherfucking TED Talk and memorize it. Bro, oh my yeah, God. I felt like I was Ted back at school, you, dude. dude. It was like, oh, Ted, I was I looking for such a... a yeah. I'm talking in But it's... it's yeah, for you. It's all right, though. It's not the weed. For every motherfucker out there, look at these no. potheads. Nah, look, no, no, you ready? No. That's I, I still did that. Ready? Yeah. It's like we ran a fucking marathon. Like That's how I feel. Exhausted. Yeah, my brain feels like slow and laggy. Yeah. Like I couldn't do a story time, I feel right. We basically like, wrote and, my and memorized a short book. That's exactly what we did. We wrote and memorized a 20 minute audio book. Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, by the way, microphone. Yeah. Fake microphone. How can the Raiders come back next year and be one of the top teams in the NFL? What do you think that they are lacking? What do you think their qualities are? And what do you think needs to be changed? <laughs> this guy. <laughs> like that? Well, the way I look at it. Uh, okay, you start. It's a professional. It is what it is, bro. Shit. You know? It is what it is, bro. Shit. That's why the Raiders are fucking losing in the first place, man. That's what the Raiders teammates are saying. It is what it is, I mean, bro. Okay, shit. So if I sit here and I say, uh, we need a new fucking coach. We need how many fucking coaches that we fucking ran through? How many new fucking hmm. quarterbacks? How many? Well, fuck, it is what it is. You know what I mean? It's still my fucking team. Mm-hmm. Fuck it. You know what I mean? This is shit. G. Man, listen, I fucking appreciate what you're saying. Yeah, you know what I mean? Like, it sometimes is what you it go is. through 30 years yeah, of Yeah, exactly, bro. Yeah, who hasn't gone through some shit like that, bro? Mm-hmm. Ain't nothing fucking new, bro. 
You know what I mean? So I mean, you got a cool yeah. stadium. Tom Brady. Uh, yeah, yeah. You Tom know what I hear about that Brady shit. Too. You guys got Bruce not. Buffer. <laughs> Fuck Bruce who? Bruce, Bruce Buffer. Bruce, who? <laughs> <laughs> Bruce Buffer fool. The let's get ready to rumble or uh, USC. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's USC. time. It's time. Yeah, yeah. You got him. You got him every Raider. Oh, have you been to the Raider game in, in, in Vegas? No. Bro, Bruce Buffer comes out and announces the whole fucking stadium. Really? Every player as they come out. Oh, wow. Get ready! And he's standing up and they have a spotlight on him. And he's a live band playing in, for the Fuck fucking... out of here, fool. <laughs> I haven't seen that shit, fool. I went to the game. To, I remember I told you I went. You did go? Remember I went with Rosie on her birthday. Oh, shit. Oh. Dude, I went to the stadium. All right. They have Bruce Buffer on a spotlight. I didn't see you post it. As they come in and they have a live band playing and they bring a band in during halftime and they play up top and you can see everybody looks like it's sick. Oh, shit. All right. No, I didn't even know that. Anyway, that's Bruce Buffer. I got to fight with Bruce in UFC for. Stop it. <laughs> yeah. Stop it. Did you have some grappling? I didn't pick him. Uh, I, didn't, I wouldn't pick him either. He's not a, not a fighter. <laughs> That's crazy as hell. All right, you ready? Let's get back on topic. Yeah, let's go. What about the Raiders or something? Yeah, and no, I was just talking shit. I know. Who cares? There's nothing you're going to say that the uh, analysts didn't say already. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, we well, what they need to do is this. Like, Al Davis is. What son, they need to do is yeah, fuck. You know what I mean, take bro? It shit. Take it away. You, you Al everything. Davis' son needs a new fucking haircut. I know. <laughs> I know. I'm sorry, Al Davis, but your hair, his haircut, his fucking haircut. Fucking can you, like can you bring doofus. up Al Davis Jr.? Haircut, just put he owner like Jim of Carrey, the right? He looks so, like the top the Jim Dumber. Carrey, uh, Lloyd Christmas, and the bottom he look. I don't understand. Look at his hair. He looks like who they based one of the fucking Dumb and Dumber off of. Look at his no. Look at the. Oh, oh, my, oh my god! god. <laughs> that's fucking worse. I'm sorry, comedy. guys. That's worse than comedy. <laughs> I, I don't know. You know that shit's fake, right? <laughs> yeah. That's the fucking be fake. And hold on, before we keep, he must got like fucking a hundred of those. Before we keep saying it, I'm sorry that we're sitting here making fun of someone's looks. That's something we shouldn't be doing at all, ever. Right. But that's a very, <laughs> very funny haircut, and we had to talk shit. Change your hair, you're a billionaire. You saw Dumb right. and Dumber. I'm sorry we're making fun of someone haircut. the way they look at shit, but <laughs> he looked. Come that, on, man. I'm sorry, but the cut's <laughs> optional. Stop it. Yeah, he looks like a There he is, right? Is it the same guy? That's better. Jesus. All right. That's, a, that's, his, that's yeah. a good haircut. That fits him. Fuck out of here, fool. That on the like right, that looks like a bowl. regular. He looks like he has a fucking chili bowl. But look haircut. at the other ones. The other ones makes him look like yeah. what do they call them? Skin crawlers. Jesus Christ. Skin what walkers. That? Oh, That's what he looked like in that <laughs> white picture. He I looked mean, like a creature. Does this girl have the same type of haircut like that? Oh, white I, walker. I have no idea. Yeah. <laughs> he had blue glowy eyes. Yeah, well, he I looks know. like a monster of <laughs> some yeah, kind. I'm so sorry, I'll do this. What do you say? No, they said change it to something else, fool. That's what they said. <laughs> Don't be talking about our leader like that, man. Yo, is Derek Carr out? You know what? I think so. Shit. I think he is out. I've mm -hmm. seen I haven't watched football mm -hmm. in so long. Fucking, um, I like, you know, they're fucking burning his jersey. I, you know, mm -hmm. like, I don't burning his to, jersey? Yeah, I mean, fuck, bro. You can't. It's organization. Yeah, it sell it. Up, sell bro. it. Yeah, that's fucking, weird. Sell it and buy a jersey that, that you like. Dude, I'll tell you this right now. Dude's going to do better wherever else he goes. I'll tell you that. He's going to break records. <laughs> fucking who knows what he's going to do. That's what happens. That's the way it always happens, yeah. bro. Yeah. You know I mean? Now, did you feel like Skip Bayless was justified in taking all the heat that he took this week? I don't know if you know about that. Uh, Around the DeMar Hamlin situation, his tweet. OG definitely does not know no. who the fuck Skip Bayless is. Yeah, he, the, if you showed him, yeah, 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 the dude yeah. that hit the fucking no. dude that just went in car. Yeah. That is not Skip Bayless. He's a, he's, a, <laughs> he's a correspondent guy. Oh, so he said something stupid than what you're saying. Yeah, if you showed him a picture, you go, oh, oh that yeah, fucking yeah, yeah. Gotcha. No, 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 I, I didn't hear about it. You know, like, I don't really, I know, I see here, he there, I see shit, but I don't yeah, really yeah, fucking yeah. get gotcha. too deep. Anyway, he was, he was just, he said some shit when that kid had a heart attack on the field. He said something like, yo, this game is important. They need to figure it out. And everybody's like, yo, you're insensitive. And that's it. But oh, before that, cool. he's a fucking dick anyway. Yeah. And he's never <laughs> been like, hey, you know what? I like him. Mm -hmm. I like him. Shannon Sharp, on the other hand. Yeah. Is different. He's an, uh, you know why? Because he's a fucking NFL legend. Yeah. And a giant horse of a man. Mm -hmm. He's as big as a horse and he's probably yeah. as fast. Yeah. Shannon Sharp is still, a fucking 60 age, year no. old yeah. peak physical fucking Bro, monster. Yeah. Still knock your ass out. He'll kill yeah. somebody. His back is like a Ninja Turtle. Oh, yeah. You filmed with him. Yeah. Fucking huge still. He showed me a picture. He was fucking big as a table. 
This is what his back is like. He was like, I've done the same thing every day for the past 20 years. Did he say he eats the same breakfast? Yeah, the he same drove exact a, shit. What, he drive like a 2000 Escalade? He's like, yeah. I bought this and I, why do you need another car? He's like, I don't go anywhere. It doesn't have any miles. I do the same shit every day. Yeah, he's like, well, fuck, wake up and do this. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah, dude, that feels a different mind. He's like, a, the, you got to watch the David Goggins, dude. Yeah. He showed me David Goggins a long time ago, but recently I started watching some of his shit. Mm -hmm. You should watch. This fool's insane. Mm. It's full runs. Yeah, you'd like ultra him. marathons. What they were called? Yeah, ultra marathons. Two hundred forty-six yeah. mile marathon runs. Yeah, like Fuck. across a state. Straight. What from here to fucking straight? Where? But he's like, like in the league. Bakersfield or what? <laughs> no, that's that's farther. No, like across Merced the state of Florida. Is Death Valley. Yeah. Oh shit. He's an endurance athlete, that Navy man. SEAL dude. Yeah. Bro, I was watching some oh, shit. Oh, he's about, a Navy SEAL. Yeah. I'm yeah. Oh, yeah. No, oh, because really he went on Rogan. That's how he got yeah. famous, yeah. really. But he has a book, and Marty just listened to his second book. I just watched some of his interviews, and the shit he's talking about, his knee, Yeah, was unbelievable. He reconstructed his entire knee. He's running on a broken leg, just running yeah. every day. And he had two holes in his heart. He set the Guinness World Record for pull-ups. He had did, like, multiple ultra marathon, 100-mile marathon. How many pulls did what he do? What is that called? Yeah, I don't good. know that off the top of my head. I uh, I forget. Oh, he said it. Fucking yeah, it had a fucking. They had to go in. He had to do two heart surgeries. So since his first book, he took two heart surgeries. Oh shit! And then um, still with the same heart though. Yeah, they oh, just no they put a there. mesh on it. Oh. And the, the heart heals around the mesh. And the, I was talking, they that, said it was the size of like a fucking coin. Oh. And he was doing seal it's called a murmur, week. right? No, no it wasn't. No, the murmur is when your heart uh, the beat is off. I think. Oh, it's off. not when you have it a was, hole in your heart? You know no. what? You know what? I think you might be right. Actually, you let us know. Or oh, we have the power of the internet. Yeah. Because no. uh, yeah, we might be wrong. You guys button. both might be right. I'm just mm -hmm. just talking. But that's like, it has yeah, to do no, with I the... That's what it's called. I have one more joint. You want to roll more joints? Or are you yeah, good? Yeah, yeah. The I DeMar Hamlin shit, too, because they said that it happened because of the specific moment he, he got, got hit. hit within his heartbeat. Like, if it would have happened at a different point in the heartbeat, his heart wouldn't have stopped. So... It was like the Kill Bill fucking two inch punch shit. So you think maybe that's what happened to Homeboy? It got hit. That's what they said. That's what why he he died on the field. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. They brought him back to life on the field and at the hospital. That's so scary, dude. Fuck so yeah. it's like all the other oh. NFL players now. If I were an NFL player, every time I got hit, okay, now you know. No, no, like, I mean you can't be scared, bro. I Everybody know you can't, but time I'm saying. To go. Yeah, you know, if it's not your time, it's just not your time. Well, that mm -hmm. too. Like honestly, I I, I played football my whole life. Watch football my whole life. So as a lot of people, that is the first time it's ever, ever fucking happened, happened it's in crazy. life. Well, you know, I don't think you know, it's they ever going to happen again. They are saying because he's rant. vaccinated or something like that. That's that was a controversial. Put that shit in. I don't, know. Yeah. I don't know, but I think you get smacked in the chest. That shit was, that's well, like no, They were actually showing motorcycle. dudes that were getting fucking hit in the chest ten a lot about Five times more harder than that. What he got, bro? Hit. He barely got hit. What are you talking about? It's just yeah, an no, angle. He, I'm saying we've seen people get. Yeah, knocked I think, to I think sleep. maybe I think maybe homeboy's elbow might have went into something, the chest, right? something, right? He might have something that we didn't see, or maybe he like dipped in. underneath yeah. with his shoulder blade and it popped in the yeah, same I time. Yeah, I mean, yeah. it doesn't something, take that yeah. much. I mean, uh, like the, even his adrenaline, maybe that he even let out too. That's another thing, bro. I mean, shit. Yeah, there's a lot of th yeah. a lot of things. I saw a diagram. A baseball could do it. The ball could do it. I mean, if it hits you in the right. I mean, shit, it's going... Oh, well, yeah, bro. You get hit in the chest and you fucking... You but, I mean, you got pads now, on bro. and shit, That's but. scary, because I'm thinking of all the times I've gotten smacked. That's not an option to... to, to what? You're stopping her from a hit? Well, you better hit me harder. <laughs> hit me harder, then, because it's not going to happen. That's how I feel. Like, mm -hmm. <clears throat> that's such a freak accident. You didn't even smoke your joint. It's like when Randy Johnson hit, oh, the, ba yeah. hit the bird with no, the baseball. That was crazy, bro. Yeah, you remember that OG? When I hit the butterfly with the drone. Same bro, <laughs> I forgot about that. Oh, that guy Peter Vinci owes his money still. Piece of shit. Yeah. Exactly. Anyway, the guy that owes his money, we did a deal with at the very beginning for a, a studio a stereo contract. We got one. the butterfly story out it's of okay. it. Yeah, we got the butterfly story out of it. And we it doesn't matter. It's just fuck that guy. Um, what the fuck? Oh, that camera. You remember Randy Johnson, the uh, pitcher, when he threw the ball and the bird went and it. Oh yeah, Pop the bird. Yep, the fucking pigeon. <laughs> yeah, that shit was crazy. <laughs> that, was <so> local, huh? <laughs> that fool's an NFL photographer now. No shit. Yeah, look it up. Randy Johnson. What does Randy Johnson do now? NFL photographer, bird photographer. Crazy, right? Bird photographer. Watch. Watch. He's Watch. a bird photographer. Watch. <laughs> I saw him taking pictures like in nature. Feels bad after that. Look at Randy Johnson. Damn, look, look. he's out there with the longest lens. He's the guy in this field in the NFL yeah. now. Oh, that's sick. I love that. 
Damn, yeah, the one that saw him take a picture of Burr, I'm like, that's pretty funny. <laughs> <laughs> he has that nightmares. Crazy? That's, so, that's, that's crazy. Yeah. Okay, let's get back into our shit. That was a long time ago. This is a segment called Where You At? Marty's going to ask you a series of things, and you say, where are you at? Meaning, how do you feel about the topic? You can move that a lot closer to you. That was such a stretch. Yeah, actually, yeah no, I was thinking about that. I was like, fuck, why did I need a Then do it. You are, okay. dude. All right, ready? Marty? All right. Go for it. Where you at? The germs. Five-second rule. Public door handles. Things like that. Bro, we're fucking, that's how we were made. We're made from germs and shit. Oh, okay. So I don't give a fuck. I don't, I don't wash my hands. What? Fuck it. No, bro. I mean, I'm not saying I'm not that guy's gonna go wash my hands for every little fucking thing. Uh -huh. I don't know, bro. That's a I different mean, way of saying that, it. Yeah. This, this is how I think this is how we're created. I think this is how we live longer. You know, just like fucking roaches. Same shit. You know what I mean? When, when you put us all in the stadium, you put all these people. Everybody's fucking breathing, and we're yeah. thinking, oh yeah, we're just bro shit. We're all right here together. We're fucking everybody's fucking. You know. Basically, you see OG in the in the street, sneeze in his face because he don't give a shit. We're all made I'm not, from it, I don't know about it. Bro. I mean, honestly, saying. no, I don't. Because you know what? The more germs you get, the more healthy, the more stronger your immune system is going to get. It's the first person to have this view. So, you know what I mean? So, uh, so I'm, not, I'm not. No, no hand sanitizer. You're not thinking about it. You know who else bro. did? Dwight Schrute from The Office. And that was a joke. But so, he's you're at the theater last night. You go down to the basement to the bathroom. The door's closed. You're just. Yeah. Okay, yeah, bro. Open yeah. it. I don't give a fuck. I'll tell you this. Like, That's why I'm like smoking joints with list. him, bro. No, no, no. Bullshit. He it's might be that. sick and he don't even know. No, what? Sick. No, no. For like <laughs> three months, what do they say? I ain't smoking with you. And I would put the joint right here and do this. Yeah, Swear to God, because he would smoke with no, everybody in the store and, and shit. Back. And was I, did I ever get sick? No, yes, you were gone for two weeks because you got, bro, I got motherfucking when the, when sickness. The COVID, when the COVID came back, I got sick. And All right, then. What is he saying? But to me, hey, bro, to me, it's better for me, shit. To me, it's not COVID. That's a fucking flu, bro. Okay, like, yeah. okay. Cool. Good standard. This okay. Is insane. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, I remember grinding my feet. I mean, during yeah. the COVID no, season, I'm gonna tell you this: like during that, the COVID season, when sense. everybody was literally fucking scared and shit, uh -huh. I was still working, and I was I would have to do the whole drop and count all the money, which all the money that's coming from out there. Oh God! And you know what? There was there was moments where I'll be kind of moment the the, oh, the moment I had the money, and I'll be like, you know, I would fucking. Touch my face. I ain't give a fuck, bro. I mean, yeah. I ain't fucking. You're not me. wearing gloves. Marty, basically. You mentioned OG just touch, yeah. that's, that's smacking the money. I mean, you got to understand. Swimming in all this cash. That's, what he, that's how he does the count. He <laughs> swims in it, and then he counts it up at night. Nah, bro. I'm just saying, bro. Fuck all that. So basically, OG yeah, doesn't yeah. use hand sanitizer. He doesn't have a gigantic bottle on his desk that he uses every time he touches money because he doesn't believe in germs. Actually, I only use hand sanitizer now with like when I fucking touch onions or some shit. Oh I'm eating a fucking taco or some shit. Then I'm like, give me the hand sanitizer or I eat King Taco or something. Because you know your fucking hands smell like onion and shit. But other than that, like fucking, you know, I'll go wash I my hands for That's the only that. reason why I'll go wash my hands for, you know. That's the only That's time the I smell don't that I can't it. stand. I'm like, bro, what the fuck is that shit? The reason I said it because you have a gigantic bottle of hand sanitizer you use while you do the count that I've seen you do. Uh, no, I, no, you see. <laughs> okay, look at it. I don't know. No, no, no. That hand sanitizer is just there because it's there. I don't fucking be it's using policy. it. The only, like I said, yeah. the only time I use people. it, if it's fucking like... I'll be honest with you. Sometimes I've gotten money and I'm like, what the fuck? This shit has blood on it. Then that's where I'm like, fuck no. I don't play that shit. You know what I mean? I, if I see blood on a bill or something, then I fucking go get the hand sanitizer and I'll fuck your mask because, you know, I, that's one thing. But other Ooh, than that, fucking. Nice. Um, no, oh, shit. What do we got on. here? Nice. New shit. New shit. New shit. So basically, where you have raw doggy door handles, he'll suck on them. <laughs> he'll fuck. He don't give a <laughs> shit, bro. Raw dog the door. Raw dog the door. <laughs> Fuck For it. Real? I will. Let's do it. I respect it. I'll he stands by it too. He's not fucking. Yesterday it. when he walked in the theater, he yeah. I opened the door with his uh, mouth. I watched no, him I do it. Bro. I mean, I don't know. That's the way it's I look at that. Teeth. The more you touch everything, the more everything you shit, your body gets more. But this is the reason why I don't share joints with him anymore. Uh -huh. Good I don't alpha. trust this fool. You just see last night when I hit the joint after he handed it to me, I did it like this. At the theater. It's fucking. Because he smokes oh, weed no, with we everybody. See, we didn't he see that. He does this shit. <laughs> fucking wipes <laughs> ash in his face. He does a bunch of shit, bro. Every day. No, every time the Raiders play, he gets ash. And he yeah. gets into the game, bro. I've seen it. <laughs> <laughs> That's fucking bad. Ash Sunday. Damn. Every OG's like wise, though. He knows things. Like, when he. 
He's like, we're He's all microorganisms. No <laughs> skills. He's wise. So. <laughs> no, 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 but you know, you're right, bro. There's a lot of things that I mean mm -hmm. that I've connected with since I was younger, and you know what I mean. And I'm, I'm not afraid, bro. That's what I'm yeah. not afraid. You just, except you might get sick once a year, basically. That's Twice how I or used to three be. times, bro. What the fuck no, are you bro. talking? I'm telling you this right now, lady. Just because this new COVID shit hit, now they're like, yeah, I've been now sick maybe once a year. I'll get it, or, or you know, or fucking yeah, some shit kicks in. But I mean, nah, that's nothing, bro. I think when I was smaller, younger, I fucking have gotten sick where fuck, bro. I literally, I shouldn't probably, I, I shouldn't even be here. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So you know, get more sick. That's cool. And now, I mean, now since I've ever got since I gotten sick like that back in the days when I was younger, bro, fuck, it's like mm -hmm. it just doesn't phase me no more. You know? Gosh, oh, went that the horrible story that you went over on episode his first episode, I believe, in uh, New Orleans voodoo. Oh no no that was that was even people. different that was another type of sickness but I mean even when I was younger I've been to some shit where like goddamn bro I'm seeing shit throughout my house and I'm fucking seeing these like this weird ass shit bro and That's you know explain this is so good just it won't from fucking being I don't know I don't know I, like I said I, I was sick and I'm seeing shit like like seeing shit you hallucinating know? yeah hallucinating bro what were you seeing Marty fuck bro everything every fucking everything you could imagine bro every fucking character. Back in the days that you could think of fucking shit, bro. Fuck Elves Kermit the Frog, bro. Chilling right there in my fucking, like, on my bed. <laughs> like, Did they give the you, like, strong doing here? medicine, too? Or you were no, just tripping no off medicine. the signal? This is just my fucking, what I'm seeing, like, just what I'm visioning. And I'm seeing it, bro. And it's real. It was real. Did you have, like, a horrible fever? Uh, You know what? Maybe, maybe not, bro. Because if I had fever, I know my mom would fucking put fucking, you know, oh, she'll... My, you know, I, my mom's Mexican shit. That's called an imagination. Shit and no fucking it's called imagination. Now, he could have been tripping out, though, if he had a bad well, I mean, fever or some shit. You could have said he was imagination, sick. but no. <laughs> but, but, I know, but this shit was real, bro. I mean, you're telling me you just spawned Kermit the Frog on your bed be, and it's just for you? Oh, bro, more than that. Just a lot of different shit, bro. And I'm just like, what the fuck? What is all this shit going on in here? Like, just, you know? Uh, and, like, it, it, from there, it just it gradually just changed and changed, like, from seeing like characters, it changed to seeing other fucking type of fucking shit. And whoa, and whoa, now as I got older, you know, it just everything just. This forgot when he was a kid, he was also eating mushroom gummies. That's <laughs> this is really what happened. He was eating mushroom gummies. He thought they were Flintstone vitamins, uh, and they were Flipstone vitamins. And he was getting shit faced all the time. Mm -hmm. This will tell me I can see like you know, when I was a kid, I used to see ghosts and shit. Not Kermit the Frog. <laughs> well, I'm you know sorry, what? No, well, I, this was this happened once. I've literally seen like all these characters one day. In my room, everywhere, bro. I'm fucking in Sounds my house. Sick as my house, fuck. In my what are you talking about? Everywhere, bro. It was just like, what the fuck? Like, uh, what happened? Like, what, you woke dreaming, up? And I wasn't dreaming, bro, because, I mean, incredible. shit, I literally remember fucking, you know, going to my mom's room and waking her up and telling her, like, fuck, and I'm still looking. I'm like, don't you see it? And she's just like, what are you talking oh, about? Oh, you were insane as a kid? Huh? You were crazy as a kid? <laughs> so what was he doing, though? He's That's just sitting there like. fucking just like, what, OG? Like, you know what? Was I he scary? I mean, this, just crazy shit, bro. And I mean, I'm not saying fucking they were like talking to me. No, okay. they were just there. And I'm like, fuck, am I tripping or what is this? You know what I mean? And, you know, now I would think ah, maybe I was dreaming. You know what I mean? I'm like, fuck, no, I wasn't fucking dreaming, bro. I can see if you're talking about ghosts, dead people, relative. You're talking about fucking characters. <laughs> yeah. Is what's you know, one time like, I see characters. Me? No, 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 no. Look, when I seen the characters, I was just like, what the fuck is this? It's some kind of like, you know, but I was, I was still young, bro. You gotta understand, I was fucking maybe like fucking five, four years old. You ever seen the movie Donnie Darko? Uh, you know what? You ever, I see, think some I have... you ever see some scary rabbits? No. But I have to. <laughs> I've seen some fucking shit, bro. You know what I mean? But I don't pay attention. But hold on. So this was when you were sick. Yeah. Uh, you know what? Or just in general? You know, nah, you know what? I was probably... Nah, you know Because I, like I said, yeah, they say fever. When you got fever so much, you can fucking... Oh, wait. Damn, so you I had, been you dead. had a if fever? You, if you had that much fever and you're seeing you shit... Go. Fuck, I, I don't remember Wait, fucking... you had a fever when you were hallucinating all this? No, 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 I didn't, because oh, I know that if oh. I did have a fever, I would have fucking... My mom would have had me fucking with rags and fucking, you know, everything. Sprite and 7-Up. Yeah, because like, there was other moments when I had fever, fucking had me this, fucking potatoes and shit. The potato fucking, shit don't work. Yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah. You know, fucking back then, they thought fucking all this shit worked, so... You know, yeah, you know, fucking, but now, you know, back then, no, I wasn't fucking... I didn't have no fever, I'm but I would figure out this. wake up, and I'll be like, God damn, like, where in the fuck... Where am I? You know what I mean? So when did it stop? It it might have stopped maybe fuck when I was like about six six years old, seven years old. Like it like uh fucking um it just changed, bro. Like in a it scary way, like they're bro. fucking with you? 
Or like yeah, no, no, no. They, they wouldn't even So did you. you ever try to interact? No, I would just like walk it was like bro, it's like if you were at Disneyland and you're going through a motherfucking oh. you're going through a fucking <laughs> ride and fuck? shit. Like that. It sounds so cool, as I wake man. up and I'm looking like what the fuck is all this shit? Yeah. Bro? Bro, that sounds like free walking, Disneyland tickets. I'm walking, I don't to my mom, I'm walking to my parents' room and looking like, damn, this is a trip. <laughs> it's like I get in there and I'm like, ben hey, I, go, I can't sleep. I go, you know, what are all these fucking, what are all these things right here? My mom's like, <laughs> shit, you're full of shit. So I'll just fucking go to sleep, you know what I mean? Like, fuck, but then I remember I'll be like, I'll look up and I'll be like, god damn, he's still there. They're staring at you? Fuck, what the fuck is that shit? Did it look like people in costumes from Disneyland, or they look like nah, the cartoons. They, they look in like the real, real fucking character, fucking shit, bro. It was like, like, like Kermit was little, or he was in a big costume. No, nah, it was like still the same character, little, same shit, staying at the edge of the bed, fucking, fucking, just walking along. <laughs> it's just some crazy shit, bro. I don't know. Maybe fucking, like I said, who knows? Maybe fucking. I think this is kind of cool. I'd this be is like hyped. Howie Mandel and uh, Ben Savage lives under the bed. Little like, monsters, yeah, or uh, yeah, little monsters. Little monsters right? yeah. Or you know, maybe even my mind back then was just so fucking. Um, you know what I mean? Because like I said, fuck, I w- shit. Like I could fucking when I was young, bro. I could fucking find a pencil and a fucking something. I could in my own head. I could make that shit into a characters, and I would just play with that. You know, exactly. Oh, all day. Toy, some certain mm-hmm. toys, and I could do. You know what I mean? So my mm-hmm. mind was just fucking. Like, mm-hmm. I would just fucking literally, I'm, I want to say fucking, um, it's just another level, bro, of thinking. I think at that age, your 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 body, your soul is so pure that, that you know, you, you, you could, you're you allowed to see shit like that. Mm. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And, and after, Look. I believe, after you hit the real world and the cussing and all that shit comes in and you start seeing bad shit and all that, mm. that's when fucking, you know, you kick into this fucking world. You know yeah, what I mean? hate that. That's I, why, you know, I look at little kids. Still, you know, from certain age and down, those are mm-hmm. little angels, you know yeah, what I mean? for sure. I, I don't want my four-year-old to stay where she's at so bad. Oh, like, oh sure. Amy's so she's cool, She's in her man. own little universe of just Fuck innocence. Yeah, and that's the fucking, that's the best, bro. She and had a win I, on I, Fortnite. I promise you that she sees shit that she's just not even telling you because she just don't even know how to explain to you. Just like I didn't know I didn't how to explain to, to my mom or nothing. Mm-hmm. I just made like, fuck, trip out. That's interesting to think about. You know what I mean? Goddamn. Yeah, because it's just so pure, bro. There's, the soul is so pure. This, once you hit this world of, of realness and everything, bro, it's just so evil here. Mm. You know I mean? But one thing I don't understand is the characters. Like, I, st- I, get, I know we keep reiterating the same bull. I've said it like six times. <laughs> I'm not going to keep saying it. Never mind, never mind, never mind. I'll stop. But that's why. I At wish I could have saw that shit. That's why. I wish Kermit was chilling in my room. Bro, are you kidding me? If Red and Stimpy were just sitting there, I'd be like, hey, man, hey, can we try to hang out uh, <laughs> beat my sister up beat up my sister for me. that's what I would have been like all these characters where's Donkey going to fuck that my sister's here go beat the shit out of her do something damn I wish I had homies like that damn we're on we're still on this Guys, the NFL playoffs are here. The wild card weekend is here. There's no better place to go than DraftKings Sportsbook. With the road to Super Bowl 57, DraftKings is ready to kick off the weekend. And you already know, they're official sports betting partner of the NFL. The Dope as Usual podcast has officially teamed up with DraftKings to bring you a brand new offer. Right now, every new customer that signs up and places a bet of $5 gets an automatic $200 to bet. All new and existing customers can get a no-sweat bet every single day of wild card weekend. Right now, even if your team loses this weekend, you get a free $10 back to bet. With deals like this, why would you bet anywhere else for the NFL? Come to DraftKings Sportsbook. As you guys know, the Packers suck this year and we're not making the playoffs, but right now I'm really, really hoping that Marty's team, the Bills, make it all the way because it's been two seasons in a row, Marty, that it's been really close. So right now, guys, do us a favor from the Dope As Usual podcast. Go download DraftKings Sportsbook app. And when you do, use code YOLA and all new customers. Remember, bet $5, get an automatic $200 to bet instantly. Guys, it's Wild Card Weekend. Remember, go to DraftKings Sportsbook, download the app, use code YOLA Bet $5, get an automatic $200. Plus, all new and existing customers, if you lose, even if your team loses, you get $10 back. This week and only with DraftKings Sportsbook. Minimum age and eligibility restrictions apply. See notes for details. I got some OG. I'm going to OG. Uh, Dude, the OG that, we, that I got right now is I'll fucking ridiculous. I haven't seen good fucking OG from you. Oh, since you're going to see this one today. Tonight, Tonight, you're going to drink a little bit? I'll take a little something. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 let's say Marty's been in public speaking now. He's like, yo, let me get some. He's got to drive <laughs> oh, home full Thomas, still. You got to get through the bottle. Look at He's got to go home still. Be yeah, careful. Home. You want to try it? You want to try it with the mineral water? It's very fucking. I think I'd puke. <laughs> really? Yeah, just water down. 
I don't know. No, <laughs> I mean, I don't know unless you, you like it. You gotta take I mean, that. I don't. I, it's like, I just write down the That hash. bottle was full when right? we started the show, guys. OG doesn't drink. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. There was like three shots left. I'm just kidding. Like three, three there was like three shots. Yeah. It is like three episodes. Yeah, it was. <laughs> That's, That's not the same. Ep- it's not the same bottles. Oh, this blueberry is crazy. Yeah. yeah you yeah, want your is. water down or no? You good? I'm good. Thank okay. you. Yeah, he's not soft. He doesn't need okay. mineral water. I don't shit, <laughs> I I'll fucking drink that whole bottle right now. I'm going to start saying that. Yeah, I bet you couldn't clean my room right now. I bet you couldn't even clean my whole house, OG. <laughs> fucking weak ass. I bet you couldn't even scrub my, my whole floor right now. Could you clean this whole warehouse? I bet you couldn't. Could you do it? Do it. Let's see. I take the reverse psychology, OG. Shit. <laughs> Man, you wouldn't even. I bet you couldn't even give me a whole pound. There's no it's way like, you could. It's a king guy. Impossible. It'd be impossible. You, you have to be. Right? You have yeah. to be too cool to do that. Nah. Yeah, actually, um, no. I got yeah, some, no. Some good. I got something good. Now, He's boy. got nothing. That's <laughs> <laughs> some good. Oh, gee, what do you mean? That's what we're talking about. Oh, before we fucking started, we, mm. we're back on right now. Yeah. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, technically, I, yes. I didn't know. We're, I didn't know it was back on you. I said, and we're back. <laughs> oh, I right, my bad. Shit. If we're filming, back. yeah. You don't pay attention to mm. shit. It's amazing. I love it. Eat the rest of the hash gummy. You're well, not even driving. Here, Mindy's cool. driving. This fucking guy. Mindy's driving. Us, what? How much? 50, <laughs> what? There's only there's five milligrams yeah, each. Yeah, five. 50 milligrams. No, Excuse I said 15 if you eat them all. 15. No. And look, it didn't even hit you. It didn't even hit you. You what pooped you it out. <laughs> 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 That's what that break was all about. <laughs> I don't know why it's not so funny. I think in the two little jabs. Like yeah. He pooped, nah, he pooped out a shark. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, this is the goofiest shit I ever thought. No. <laughs> Real kid coming out. It's so stupid. It's a new dopest promo. What happened? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. That's the goofiest shit ever. All right. Let's get back on to the fucking show. I can't ask him. <laughs> Can't ask him a fucking serious question. <laughs> <laughs> you know what sucks is you can't stop this right now. Everybody's just in your head. Imagine OG <laughs> pooping out candy, and now everybody has seen it. This <laughs> <laughs> fool. You better hilarious. stop fucking smoking that shit, fool. Fucking up your head. <laughs> <laughs> it's eating your brain up. Oh. God damn. Okay. Okay. So, how do you feel about... What the fuck was that? Were you coming with your border patrol? <laughs> All right. <laughs> Not yet. Back to where you at. Continue, Marty. No. Hello. I already have somewhat of an idea, but you can elaborate on this. Where are you at with superstitious shit in your head? Counting numbers, knocking on wood. Is that us? I don't know. My, I think my phone was the us. first one. Falling oh, it's off. over there. Right, oh, yeah. it's fine. It's fine. I thought it kept, well, something was falling <laughs> off our shit. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. Go. All right. So overall superstitious shit going on in your head. Knocking on wood. Counting numbers. Even odd numbers. And Yeah. All day. You want to know how much of a white girl OG is? He drinks wine, Starbucks, and he carries crystals. <laughs> <laughs> Man, take out the fucking Starbucks. I'm not a Starbucks person. He drinks hella teas and coffees from Starbucks. No, Sorry, Pete's God. coffee. I don't fuck with Starbucks. Pete's dude. coffee. No, Where do you I don't go? Fuck with Starbucks. I see you every Sunday morning on your drives with a cup in your hand, driving. That's my. Me that's me my beer. With, I don't know how you hold. That's my beer. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. He's not driving. Let's not say OG was just driving. Let's say he was parked. <laughs> Fucking asshole! <laughs> Every fucking Sunday, he's like, you know what, Sunday, I feel fancy. <laughs> I'm gonna sippy cup it today. <laughs> Every Sunday. Yeah. No, that's, that's my me. beer. Then, you know what? That's me. I'm looking. So what I'll do is on Sunday I'll wake up. I'll, I'll get a dude. beer. I mean, I'm not. I mean, I'm not. I'm, drunk. Drunk. I'm not doing. I'm not drunk driving. You know, I'll tell you that now. Don't fucking stop. Do stop but speaking about the stop. whole thing. Listen this to this. All what I'll do is fake. I'll drink a beer. Well, I'm waiting to, my, to where I go have breakfast. I'm, and I have breakfast literally not even a fucking mile away from my house. So stop at the store, grab a beer. I'll pour it in my, in my cup. So, you know, fucking having a cup, get to a fucking place, have breakfast, and boom, done. But I always have, you know, I'll have my beer while I'm going over there because 
What am I gonna do? I don't know. Fucking chug a whole fucking look like I'm chugging a fucking thirty two ounce in the driveway before you walk in. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? So usually where I get to a spot where I'm gonna have breakfast, then I chug it right there in the parking lot, then I go inside and have eat? breakfast. Yeah, you know, and that's it. I'm done hey, drinking. You know what I mean? Hey, I forgot this for my was Sunday, before just, breakfast. Bro, I'm sorry, but this is the <laughs> shit that you don't see in Buffalo. This is the shit you don't see what do you when mean? he's hung over and fucked up. He mixes clamato. And a Budweiser, or whatever the oh. fuck he drinks, and he—that's I feel better. No, you don't feel better. <laughs> you just get fucked up again and forgot that you felt like shit. And I feel better. The feeling like shit. <laughs> okay, right, 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 right. I take it all back. You're right. You, know I mean? you do feel better. You, you can do. spend you can spend a whole morning no, throwing right. up and right. feeling sick in the stomach. You just pound that fucking beer. Or you can just become an alcoholic. Get fucked up again, but you don't fucking feel that. You know. Then later on, you gradually, just stop drinking, and it just goes away. You know I mean? That sounds like, like methadone clinic, but at home. Yeah. <laughs> sounds like you got a problem. Alcohol as medicine <laughs> for the alcohol. God damn. <laughs> Did you hear what I'm saying? You got a problem. <laughs> hey, I'm not going to say a problem, but you know, fucking, I like to fucking drink here and there. Uh huh. On the weekend. You should be a Bills fan. Yeah, you should be. He breaks tables. At casinos. <laughs> this fucking guy. So what's up? You superstitious or what? You're knocking on wood? You breaking wood tables? Yeah, fuck yeah. For sure. Always. Bro. I'm a fucking what kind oh, of num- crystals. What kind of number shit do you got going on? Are you like counting even and odd numbers? Of- everywhere, bro. Everywhere I go. Any number that appears to me, any number that's in front, license plates, everything, I go by all that. But does it? It's what I'm thinking. Not If, if, I'm, I'm not, if I just see a, a license plate... And I see a number that like, you know, but my thoughts are not where I'm. What I'm whatever I'm thinking, and I see that number, it, it's nothing. Hey, do me a favor. Only put that mic I'm, in front of you. Only if I'm. Um, there you go. If, <laughs> if, there you go. If I'm thinking about something in my head or trying to, you know, do some shit or mm-hmm. you know, just whatever, and I see numbers, then I get my answers back like that. Like sometimes I'll have it where I'm thinking about a specific number, and then they say it at the same time of the shit that I'm listening to. All the time. Oh, that's Is that what you're talking about? Dude, no, you're talking about seeing license plates and the certain numbers. Like, cool, I saw the certain number that it didn't matter. But if he's thinking of something, looks up and goes, oh my God, it's right in fucking front of me, then it matters. Mm. Signs are around all day, but do they matter to you? I see signs on the freeway, but that's not my fucking exit. Yeah. Like, fuck that sign. That's yeah. basically the way I think about it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, I yeah. mean, shit, same shit here. You know what I mean? It's just, it depends what I'm doing, like, where, mm-hmm. where, my, where my mind, where my thoughts are at yeah. the moment. Then that's when I'll, then I'll take, then I'll start looking at numbers and shit. If I get them, in front of me, then I know, okay, that's a, that's a sign, and I already know what mm. usually some numbers mean. Do you believe in, like, numerology and shit? You seem like somebody that. Yeah. So what does that what does that mean to you? Well, shit, that means a lot to me. That tells me a lot who I was in my past life. Mm. You know what I mean? And, um, like, you know, where, who I was, like, back, back then, you know, I, I believe that we all been, I mean, everybody, it's like all of us in this room, I believe that we've been somehow in our past life We've we've interact together. We work together somehow, mm-hmm. and now we're all now we're still brought back to this place, but in just different forms. Now you know what I mean. Mm-hmm. And and our next life, it's going to be a whole different form again. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean. And that's not the even way people. Think. Maybe well, not. No. Maybe, yeah. No, I, I feel that everybody that comes into your life is somebody that was in your past life, mm. in your other life that you. Oh, for sure. I feel I met and know people that I met in a past lives, like Rosie's grandpa. Yeah. Fuck. For sure. Well, wow, come on, well, you have know, that same that, dream yeah, over, sure. and over and over. Get fuck out of here. For sure. I mean, and maybe it was like, yo, you did such a good deed. When you reincarnate, you're going to smoke weed for a living <laughs> or something. You're like, yo, me saving that kid in the 40s. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, I don't know what it is because I think yeah. of shit like that all the time. Mm-hmm. What did I you, do in you a past even, life? Yeah, even in your past life, awesome you, life. Yeah. in your past <laughs> life, they might even be, they were probably even enemies of yours. Mm-hmm. And now in this life, Different they're context. not. They're there. But, mm-hmm. the, but they still play the same role. You know what I mean? It's mm-hmm. like a Call of it's, Duty. Lobby it's it's like it's it's still an enemy, but it's an undercover enemy. But he's here. You mm-hmm. know what I mean? Damn, that yeah. looked at me from this glass. Fuck out of here! <laughs> you know I know we mean? can't but, tell. They're I mean, blackies. shit. That's just the way I look at it. Like that, you know what I mean? I look at shit like yeah. that. Yeah, you know what I mean. Put so, the time on there. Mm-hmm. anybody on there, just so I can keep stay track. Yeah, one time. Anybody, anybody who um, comes in your life, so the universe brings everybody back into mm-hmm. your life. Another. Yeah, all the time, all the time. You know? There's sometimes where I feel you don't like mean nobody for no reason. There'll be like aha moments where you'll get a synchronicity like that, where it's like I'm fucking thinking about something so specific, and it just popped up in what I'm listening to or, or saw, and I just take that as like you're in the right place, you're doing the right thing, just keep doing what you're doing. That's just how you know I let that because sometimes it's just like what the fuck. But I'm talking ever, about maybe two three times a year. Do you ever have like these fucked up thoughts and you're like, what the fuck am I thinking? 
Exactly. Of course. You know All what day, mean? every day. Yeah, you know what I mean? In what context? Yeah, like fucked up, up as a general. Yeah, just you no, know, like a like, fuck, just fucked up thoughts, general of anything. Just like yeah. fuck, bro. Uh, can you roll that joint? You know, like just shit that you just yeah. don't want to happen. Of course, I think I consider worst case scenario. Or like, oh shit, like, today's the day lot. you're gonna die. Uh huh. Jesus you know Christ. I mean? Yeah, worst or, case or, scenario. Can you I do that? that all the time. Like, like it's almost my OS. It's almost right. Or it's today that fucking <laughs> today's the day that I gotta look out for fucking nope. this. You know what I mean? Yeah. And you know shit like that. You know. Yeah. Sorry, I forgot. Just, just some fucking, yeah. you know what I mean? It's I think about shit. shit like that, and then I scale it back to just, like, being grateful for just having a exactly, good bro. Think about that. Oh, yeah, no, for yeah. sure. No, I mean, what you just got to do, I mean, because that's not really actual signal you send out, you know what I mean? It's, it's more just like a thought. Yeah, there's a difference between yes. like an intention and just a random yeah. thought that keeps fucking popping you know, up. Yeah, exactly. That's why, you know, sometimes, you know, people fuck up and... What they do is they they um, they mistaken their thoughts with their what they're sending out and they send it out instead of you know they think it's a thought but no you're actually sending that shit out. That's why I always tell motherfuckers that I know when they get all negative and start talking shit and being dicks or being it's like bro you yeah. have no idea that you're doing it again it's gonna happen again mm-hmm. and keep happening all the negative bullshit because all you do <sighs> is talk about other people and how they're fucking up when you're not yeah, doing anything sure. about yourself when they said last night there was a little girl that mr beast like they did this thing this like charity actor in the show when they said she was like 15 she's been battling cancer since she was two. Oh, oh i was like that's yeah. fucking that changed that. everything right i was all like what the Ooh. fuck so the girl was in a wheelchair and they brought her up and donated to her family and stuff but just when i thought about that like damn like just circumstances like that that you do it into the mic loud avoid. as fuck while Marty's talking. That's his trademark move with this shit. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> Marty's all sincere moment talking about the little girl. <laughs> Fucking girl, oh my god! Yeah, that's pretty cool. <laughs> <laughs> that was that's like a soundboard. He was that was emphasis for how nice it was. Yeah, that's pretty cool. God damn. Those are like some symbols. <laughs> Car- yeah, he's fucking the symbols. Yeah, but Thank no, that you. was some fucked up shit, though, right? No, bro, multiple. <sighs> just grind up a little bit. Yeah. The hell's mad at you? Yeah. Chris Tucker yeah. strain. And oh, also. You want me to roll up a few joints? I'll yeah. No, there's one so we can share it. I don't want to smoke. Yeah. The joints you smoke. You want to smoke after you hit my mom? I wipe it. Motherfucker, just because I don't trust him. You hear his germaphobe <laughs> shit? <laughs> he fucking licks the ground at subways and shit. Uh uh-uh. uh. Those are good mic crumbs down there. For you no, bro. We were in Vegas on the strip. He his feet were planted. He put his chest on the ground and just slid across the ground. <laughs> oh, it's dirty as shit. This was oh, hella guy. dirty. Pretty he starts slid on the strip. <laughs> He ran and slid on his stomach. As hard as he could. <laughs> Just it's with his tongue out. <laughs> you know, this whole time now, people are imagining you shitting whole candies. People imagine you sprinting and sliding on your stomach down the street. That's funny as fuck. And by the way, OG's got hella weird ass tattoos too. So now you can think of you should you should post that. weird tattoos. You have a gigantic octopus coming across your chest. What are you talking about? That's a fucking multitasking motherfucking octopus. You don't you know multitask I mean? though. Bro. Bro, I can't talk, talk to you while you're playing a game. This is the the epitome of not multitasking. What's up, bro? No, no, I'm just playing the call of duty. What's up? What's going on? No, you don't speak. What's up, Yodi? <laughs> You know what? It's because look it. I'm Let talking. I'm talking. Gut. I'm talking back in my days, like you know when, when when I first had my kids and shit. And you uh-huh. know what I mean? Yeah. I used to fucking. I was working. Fucking. I was a uh, worked. At, I was a dock. Fucking uh, supervisor at a dock. I was a fucking. Um, I was a pool man. Fucking too. I had my own pool route. And I fucking sold weed. So I had three motherfucking jobs in one fucking day. Okay. That's and, not multitasking. You know I mean? Multitasking ass. doing multiple things at once. Exactly. You're so not what? cleaning the pools bro, and I'm fucking cleaning, I'm, I'm, sacks. No, bro. I'm cleaning my fucking pools and pools. People are pulling up already at the houses that they know I'm there. Mm, I'm yep. already back. Mm. Here you go. All here right. you go. You are multitasking. Okay, you are multitasking. Um, you know what I mean? Exactly I'm fucking, then I pull up to my job and then okay. people are coming in there asking for an application where they're just there oh, to pick yeah, up weed. Yeah. <laughs> you know, the fucking secretary's like, 
damn, you know, we don't have, we ran out of uh, um, like 80 <laughs> applications today. <laughs> and it was people just going into my fucking job, yeah. picking weed up and asking for an application to just to fucking multitask play it out. force out and there. there. Yeah. Some yeah. fucking so shit like that. Bro. You know what? <laughs> so that's why I got you the are right. That you is multitasking. I mean? Just fucking. But how about this? Is that this? literally what? Uh, hold on. Just, you have a literal octopus tattoo. It's across <laughs> and his that's whole what it fucking represents? chest. No, I got one across right here. The thing chest. is, the, the octopus's face is Danny Trejo. <laughs> it's a whole octopus. <laughs> Danny Trejo face and hair. <laughs> Remember his head on the tortoise in Breaking Bad? Like that. Oh. Yeah, that oh. Except it's an octopus. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking callbacks. Oh, God, love it. That was today. That was good. That was today. Woo. I'm not that high. Far. Maybe that's why. Yeah, but you know that's what it was that you know that's why I got the octopus for, you know because that's a cool Pablo, I literally felt like the moment I left my house to go fucking you know to do my pools because that was my first thing I would was go busy, do. like yeah. fucking it was just like fuck bro the day went so quick because fucking just I'll tell you right now I would break down maybe about two pounds in fucking one one fucking one day. Get the fuck out of here. How, sure. But what increments are they going out in? Just like bro, know. half ounces, ounces, mm-hmm. fucking even eights, even fucking P- eights. Dubs. The best to sell. Hold on, bro. but you're doing pools of houses. Yeah, so you yeah. got and this was all. This was all like uh, Friendly Hills, all the way fucking La Habra, fucking uh, Orange County, uh, Anaheim Hills. You know what I mean? And you know that's where all my peeps were at too. You know what I mean? Everybody like, oh fuck, could you bring me two ounces tomorrow? Could you bring me an ounce tomorrow? Could you bring- Next thing you know, even even some of my pool customers, I would make them my uh-huh. fucking customers. It's yeah. pretty sick. Well, I should I would do about uh, 30, 30, 38 pools, almost forty pools a day. God damn! What? Now you're telling me you're cleaning forty pools a day. Roll that joint and stop lying. <laughs> forty pools a fucking day. Man. No man. Roll that hybrid ass <laughs> weed that you said was an OG. I can tell from the bottom of that weed that that structure is not OG fully. Fuck here. Stop. Turn the nug on the bottom. Look at that. Give me the other nug. Let me see that. What? Look at the bottom of the nug. Throw it. <laughs> yes. <laughs> You're going to tell me right now that this is the fire OG that you're saying. Or is this the nugs that you brought out of there? What? what That's out of that jar, right? No, this is the nug he brought out of his bag. Oh. Yeah. This is different weed. I can yeah. see by the structure. Oh, yeah, yeah, No, this is not the one you had right no, there. No, it's not the one. Yo, I've never done this. Let me see if I can flick this motherfucker. This is a whole like new a sport right here. Come on. <laughs> Come on. Do it. Do it. Do it. Not Go like this. Go like this. Come it. on. Come on. Just do it real quick. While we're on the show. We're not doing it. This, no. this, is a, this is a loose episode. <laughs> so <at> least. <laughs> That's a loose episode. We were all really fucked up. From the TED Talk, I'm like, oh my God, we didn't do an episode yet. We've been so busy. Like, OG, oh come over here, fool. Let's talk about some your Danny Trejo tattoo. All it's, OG's tattoos mean something. And uh, he carries crystals. I'm pretty sure his name's Becky. At this point, your name is Becky, OG. Fuck out of here. <laughs> Fuck you, can you put your fucking fingers up so I can score? Come on. Just because the Raiders can't kick, let me fucking try. Give me one. Let me, let me do it. Oh, you want to do that? You still want to <laughs> fucking do that? I've been saying it. <laughs> I've said it 40 fucking times. High level oh, you right want there. it. Right. Oh, you want to do that. Come on, just one. One little time. No, just put your hands up. The fucking if you, you got to catch your, it with your teeth. No, like, uh, yeah, right? That's what I'm saying. Matrix. No, <laughs> if you pull out your fingers farther, I can make it. Come on. It's either no, that or it's no. going to hit you randomly when you're rolling the joint. I don't think it's going to make it, man. All right, let me see if I can hit you in the face then. No. Then put your fingers out. Come shirt. on. Real quick. Real here. quick. All right, then put your hands out. I'll make it. Oh! <laughs> this fucking man. That was, that was, that was a good yeah, shot. That was a good yeah. shot. If the field goal was up, you would, that yeah, shit would have been good. Yeah, if he would have cared, we would, ooh, that smells delicious. This is amazing. This is like oh, a trip right, right here. Oh, this blueberry is going crazy. Yeah. Hey. Oh, hey. That shit, yeah, that's hey, you. Man. Thanks for rolling that joint. So, by the way, OG telling you doing 40 pulls a day. I, I really did those pull-ups like last episode. Of the That's the same as me. I did those pull-ups yeah, last yeah. episode. I really yeah. did them. No, you did. Yeah, you're busting out like 40, 50 a fucking I'll minute. I'll tell you this. Okay, I you aside. I would do 40 pulls a day. And um, so I would always take somebody with me, right, to help me. Like I would take a Oh, helper, somebody else I did pay, it. I would, pay, you know, I would pay one of my helpers all the time. I would take somebody. I will take either my little nephew. I'll take my, you know, my compadre. I'll take my fucking... 
my, you know, my cousin or someone. He pointed at me. <laughs> say, this, oh, my cousin. No. Nah. So, you know, fucking, we just fucking um, do the pool then. We would, we would say, fuck that it. Today it's going to be in and out service. That microphone. <laughs> that means we're, gonna saying, go, we're, doing we're going in and we're going fucking out and fucking quick. <laughs> so you didn't clean the pool? No, no, no. Fuck yeah. No, no. We Do we me a favor. Move that microphone in front of you. There you go. We would still fucking do the pool, but it was fucking, we would do it fucking fast, bro. Fast and quick, get the fuck Quick little skim. Yeah. So basically you would do a shit job so you could sell weed faster. <laughs> and you made your little... He went there, nephew. sold the sack, and fucking left is what he <laughs> said. <laughs> Still leaves floating around. He never did shit. You had a pool, man. No, you know what? Um, I would do pools fucking like from 8, eight in the morning. No, from 7 in the morning to 2 o'clock in the afternoon. 2 o'clock in the afternoon, go back home, fucking re-up, get more weed, go to mm. my second job. And at the do- at the unloading shit, yeah, the where you dock. guys were stealing so much that they uh, put cameras in to see who was stealing, and then you all got fired. Oh uh, no, shit, no, that was, <laughs> that was a different place. Yeah, no, actually, because uh, that story is hilarious. Which one was it? Okay. You tell me, Wait, motherfucker. Which place no, you get fired from? I went through a few fucking Craig. Through a few docks. That's what I'm saying. Which dock did I tell you? Which one was it? Damn, I wish to get all the new friends. Yo, can I tell the story real quick? Go. You know me. what? No, I want tell you. Me. Tell me the story of why you got fired for sweaters. Oh, <laughs> you told me the shit recently. Oh, it's a sitcom. Can you just we fucking just um, say it? But roll that. So we were joint. so we were all coming up. Everybody's coming up in this company, bro. It was fucking. There's Nike sweaters and shit, and we all got Nike sweaters and fucking. Next thing you know, they say, "Hey, we just opened up a new company in uh, Fontana. You guys want to go down there?" And, Fucking work over there. You guys, you guys actually gonna be lead men, fucking managers, whatever. Right? So we're like, fuck, you know? Yeah, let's go. Okay, you guys, you guys have an interview. Um, you guys have an interview tomorrow. You know, at fucking nine a.m. So we're like, all right, cool. Well, we all fucking met up over there at nine a.m. and we're all fucking wearing the same fucking Nike sweater. This motherfucker <laughs> left off ninety-two percent of the story. Everybody, fucking all he did up. was tell you what happened at the end. <laughs> You have no idea why he was there, what he was doing. My God. All right. Well, before that, we were coming up on sweat. We were coming up on fucking. They you know, were stealing shit from the dock. Yeah, we were working at a dock. So fucking, hey, we were coming up. Fucking, we had sweaters. We had jerseys. We had anything you want, bro. Fucking good shit. Everything. Fucking, uh-huh. Everything I went to. So we got these fucking sweaters and we're like, fuck it. Next thing you know, we're like, you know what? We're about to take, we're supposed to take these sweaters because these sweaters were like very expensive, like maybe 120 bucks. So right. we took a few for us and then fucking the rest were like, you know what? Fuck that, you know, I can't take them. I'm not going to take them. So I tell this guy, you know what? Go throw them in the trash. Just because, you know, you don't want to fucking, you don't want to fucking leave no evidence around. Mm-hmm. This guy threw them back in the trailer, send the trailer off to Fontana where we're going to go get a job in the next few weeks. We're not thinking about it. So, you know, supervisor, the, the manager or whatever, the regional, uh, yeah, fucking the, the boss over there, fucking, he gets his fucking trailer with sweaters that were open and, look, okay, cool. Well, now we get offered these positions to go back over there to run shit over there. We're like, fuck it. Well, nobody even knows, but we all fucking, it was a cold fucking morning. We all fucking pull up to, to the fucking parking lot and we all get off with the same <laughs> fucking sweater, bro. Everybody's wearing the same fucking sweater. God. Fucking manager, fucking supervisor, fucking spots it out right away as we're fools were trying to change the sweaters and shit. It's, you sh- I mean, I appreciate the effort. <laughs> this fucking but even the second swing at that, you still have so many. I still don't know what happened. Can I just? Oh my god! I hate you so, right, so much. Oh, oh, oh my god! This fucking he was guy stealing so much stuff. Say, they were stealing so much. They set up cameras. OG and his friends. Well, stole. no, that's another spot. That's another. Oh spot. God! OG that's was stealing why. so much shit uh-huh. that they had to investigate on who was stealing all the Nike sweaters, and instead they promoted. <laughs> These guys, because like we got to f- filter out these people. These are our good guys. They sent them to the new spot, and they kept trying to figure it out. And they all wore the same fucking stolen Nike sweater on the same day to their oh interview. God. And they all go, "Are those the sweaters that we're looking for? You guys are fucking fired." And that's what happened. I'm gonna fucking box you. Now I understand. Now you get it. Thank you. Uh, fuck. This was our TED talk. That was actually my speech from TED talk. And then he fucking stole the sweaters. Cut to OG fucking firing people and shit for stealing now. <laughs> oh shit! Oh shit! I didn't think about 
watching the cameras. <laughs> he watches cameras all day to find weasel tits. He's finding himself. That's why he knows <laughs> so well. He's a fucking expert. Who yeah, you're like Ocean's fucking dress. <laughs> 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 Yo, that joint finally no, got I mean, lit. That's we crazy. Used to, we used to, we used to come no, pass it. Don't just leave it there. We used to come up pretty sick. Bro, back just, in the day. Hold on, sorry. Nah. You were going to leave the joint there burning and there's another joint? Can you pass the other one? That's like some shit from the movies. No, that's all you, bro. No, I wouldn't I wouldn't advise smoke with OG. No, Be careful. You're good, my boy. Oh, no, it's to his lips. You know, you're my boy. <laughs> it's to his lips. Marty's infected. <laughs> Marty, nah, nah, nah. Marty's nah, shoes nah, just bro. turned into Cortez's. He's wearing a goatee lip. It's growing. <laughs> it's growing. Yeah, you got to do that. <laughs> then go. Let's take a shot, Brody. Damn, your shoe. Oh, my God. Your socks are getting higher by the minute. It's like Spider Man. If you smoke off an OG joint, it's like getting bit by a radioactive spider. <laughs> oh my god, that's a really good fucking bit. I wish we had like graphic people to do that. No. That's, that's pretty fucking funny. I hit it. <laughs> Pro clubs tag sticks out. <laughs> <laughs> we well, got a pro club on right now, Mijo. I know. That's why I did that. <laughs> like in Space Jam with all the, the yeah, spice yeah. go. The pro club's gonna hit you up tomorrow for the morning. Ba, 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 and it's get close on immediately. <laughs> They're gonna oh hit you up tomorrow my morning. God. That's it. That is fucking amazing. I love every piece of that. Where are we at? Oh my months. God. 1 30. We're trying to do an hour and a half because we have to. Marty has, One day. Sorry, I'm sorry. Marty has to edit this in less than a day. Oh, really? His TED Talk fucked us. Not fucked us. Fucked us up as like in Workflow. four or five days straight. We didn't do anything but it. So okay. we didn't do a podcast. We were gonna do this one on Wednesday. I'm proud of that fucking speech. I can't wait for you guys to hear that. Yeah, I'm speech. stoked. I'm stoked. Oh, yeah, but no. also, we learned a lot about OG. A lot today. Uh, yeah, what you learn about? We learned that you have live, laugh, love deep inside of you, but you just won't let it out. Yeah. Your live, laugh, love is covered by a Mexican flag. <laughs> That's what I see. <laughs> Yo, if you imagine OG did his own podcast, like Bill Burr does, uh -huh. there's a comedian OG called named Bill Burr. He goes in his basement, Monday morning podcast, goes in his basement, no camera, and just talks into the microphone for like an hour every Monday. That's it. About what the fuck's on his mind. And half of it's like, you know, fuck this. And half of it, he's just so upset. <laughs> right? Could you imagine OG's Monday morning podcast? You know, man, just get out there. Stop being a little fucking bitch. And start with weasel titsing around with your life. That'd <laughs> be kind of hard. Like, That'd be sick. You got to have it be like, he doesn't know it's recording. And he's just bitching about shit. And ranting. Yeah. Did you notice this whole episode? You've been turned away from the camera the whole fucking time. Thanks for that. It's going to be great to edit together. I'm sorry, Marty. He's talking right into this fucking one that keeps dying. Okay, that's perfect. So we can't get any of the angles of you. It's so sick. But besides that, you didn't get all weird and, t and get all shy and fucking no, curl no, up no, this episode. No. I know, but the mic's so far from me. That's the only thing. Bring Hola. it to you. Hola. There you go. There you go. There you go. It's a, it moves. It moves. Did you guys steal these? Uh, no, hell no. They probably didn't have these back then. <laughs> they did. It was back in uh, 2004. So, Dan, that's, I'm mm -hmm. sorry, that's crazy. We learned a lot about him. Mm -hmm. he, he finds these thieves because he's looking for himself. He's this looking for his former self. Like, I know what you're doing. This is deep. I used to do that yeah. shit. I'm looking for myself. This is that's deep. crazy. You're <laughs> finding yourself. This is going to be his fucking TED talk. <laughs> no, I found myself. <laughs> And he had gotten I away for it, it with six pounds already. So I knew what I had to do. I had to beat the shit out of him. God damn. No words? But no, yeah, shit. So that's that's why I have the octopus. Back to my octopus. Wow. Look at he's a, a fucking pro these days. Fucking and then he touched his me. own yeah. tattoo. The, 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 the asking I love phase. it. And don't get me wrong, shit. At any moment, I could always do what I always do. You know what I mean? Mm. I could always fucking multitask. There's no. But you're not meant to. As you get older, you're meant to like earn more and do less. At least that's what you yeah, want. Yeah, but you know what? If you really think about it, it's still it doesn't stop, bro. The multi like it's like you know, multitasking never stops. Just like him, you, mm -hmm. no matter what, you guys might. I don't know if you guys don't see it, but you guys are multitasking, bro. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. What are you yeah. doing? You're with your family, your kid. You're being a father, your husband. You know, you're working. Yeah. 
Damn, you're trying to fucking, you know, do <coughs> fucking. Marty's a bus driver world, during you know? the it's day. It's a fucking multitasking world, you know what I mean? Yeah, for damn so sure. Very that's true. That's the way I look at it, you know? That's why I got an octopus, you know what I mean? Fucking. I like that. That's what we all are, you know? We got, all are octopuses in one way or another. Uh, you know symbolic. I mean? That was one of them. And then the other one is just, you know, the octopus is just, you know, it's one of the smartest creatures. I was going to say that. In the ocean, you mm-hmm. know what I mean? And uh, the way he catches his prey and shit. You know, he's a fool. He's a fool. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, speaking of the ocean. Next question. Okay. If you had to solo, pick one. Deep sea cave diving or skydiving? If you had to do it. Alone. Alone. I would say uh And you're deep forced. Sea. You'd rather deep sea? Yeah. Wow, it's the first time we've the heard that. The sea, sea doesn't scare it's me. An anomaly. The ocean don't scare no. you? Are you no, fucking serious? I can go in there. I go in there. I do it all the time. Mm-mm. I'll go in there. No, thanks. no problem? No. No problem. You're just, you're good. You see, he's good it. with like just the, he's one. Either. Like yeah, he doesn't. No, I don't sweat the no. He just doesn't care about yeah. sharks. But that's what that means though. If I, if I get bit by me. a shark, I get bit. Sharks don't worry me. I mean, the sharks, it's like getting bit by a shark. That's one in a million, right? It's like a fucking in a plane crash. Mm. But you know you're 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 more bound to get in a car accident and die there than fucking get get bit by Damn, a shark. Damn your odds thing, you're really sticking to it. Yeah, well, because that sucks. You know, when people tell me that all day, you're more likely to crash on the way. But I'm driving the car. If I at least I'll be mad at myself. The pilot like, hey man, you having a bad day? Mm-hmm. Took it out on us. Fuck you. But it's very rare. <laughs> yeah, it's very rare. But I don't want to be on that very yeah. rare flight. I mean, it's I look at it like this. To me, I look at it like this. It's a fucking it. If that's what it is, bro, it's a fucking it's a it's a ticket, bro. You you fucking win that golden ticket to your next life, mm. and which is gonna be amazing mm. and better than this life. Mm. So shit. If that's Let's not drive with OG no more. You know what I mean? Let's not get in the car with this fucking dude. <laughs> if it's our time, it's our time, Brody. Red light, fuck a red light. You know what I mean? You just Becky. Got, I mean, uh, shit, Becky. That's just, I feel you. Know, yeah. Stuff, yeah. Whether if you if it's a plane crash that's gonna happen. Or it's that accident that's going to happen. Or it's going to be that guy that's going to shoot you. That's the way. That's your exit out of this life, bro. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. No big. Um, thank you. Not all all three of you shaking your head going, no. <laughs> but it's okay. That's well, what whatever you think it is, bro. Think. I think where they think. I mean, like they say, we're all, I mean, we're all going to die, right? I mean, shit. We're, no matter where, we can never run from that shit. It's you all just don't want to worry. We can avoid the shit. Because the opposite yeah, of that of is worrying. Can, you know, but even though, regardless, it's still there. And we all don't know how it's going to This will dies first living in Final in this Destination. World, we don't know. Right? He just doesn't dodge the brick falling. <laughs> we, I'm just saying, you know, you know, living in this world, you don't know, bro. It's fucking, you know, it's a mm. fucking, it's like, tell me, when you, when you decide to go put gas, sometimes you think about, oh, shit, you know, you think ahead of what, before you get to that gas station, you're already thinking what, what could happen or what yeah. you should do in case something happens. Of course. You know what I mean? So it's the same shit, bro. And if mm. it's going to happen, it's going to fucking happen. There's times where you're probably pretty guys. You're like, "Fuck, bro! Right now, easily somebody could just fucking rob my ass, and mm-hmm. you know what I mean, and it could fucking happen." So, yeah. it's 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 there, bro. It's just it's there. Mm-hmm. You can't run, you can't run from that. You, mm-hmm. you could literally I mean, run from it. No, you can <laughs> what dodge you? it. What you're saying, right? You can dodge. He's shit talking about there. worrying about things. I'm just bro. saying, you know, I'm, why worry about it? I don't oh, worry. oh shit. it is what it is. That's fucking wild from you, telling me not to worry. When I was going to Vegas, you're like, you ain't strapped, you ain't bringing nothing. You want me to ride with you? I'm like, I'm just driving to Las Vegas. And you're <laughs> yeah, saying I'm not to worry. About, I'm saying because, yeah, because I know the type of world. That's why, like I said, like I told him, fuck, we, you know, fuck, we, even though we're going to Vegas, shit, I like to still bring my shit with me, you know? Fucking doesn't not matter. Not that, for I'm saying in general, like, you worry all the time. It's not that I worry about, but I try. I try to. I take my precaution. Thank to look, you. You take precaution. But, but I'm not. I, but at the point when it comes down, I'm not gonna be fucking. Oh shit! Nah, it is what it is. Are you saying you wouldn't be scared to go deep sea cave, no. cave diving though at all? No, no, not at all. No, no I've problem. I mean, I've ju- I, even, I, 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 I jumped in the beach fucking at night. Different. You know what I mean? Different. We're and and you know you can't see nothing. You can't see that, you know, even oh. in the daytime, mm. you can't see nothing. You know. Oh hell! I honestly, you gotta pay me. At least so much. <laughs> 1.5 in cash <laughs> to get in the fucking ocean at night. 
I'm not getting under enough or less than that. It's not, not even just happen. sharks. It's so it's much shit. everything <laughs> on earth that could be under there. <laughs> right now, thinking of being in fucking darkness with water, I feel like a little kid that's yeah. like about to get jumped. Like, no, I'm just going to get jumped. The up. water itself will I'm just going to curl up and drown, bro. The temperature of the water will Dude, kill even you. in GTA under the water, I... I have I can't I fucking can't do it I can't do the POV view I can't <laughs> really it fucks me up dude I don't know what it is I can't do the underwater shit. that's crazy because past life maybe shit. heights get me like that when I see people fucking same with heights just What's seen a fuck? video of someone in heights it gets me like a little oh what the fuck what are we on? but I mean not that a fucking um jumping off a plane wouldn't interest me I mean shit I, I would love to do that that's I think wait you, you would, would? That either? yeah I would. you would do that yeah. I'll learn all these new things that I talked to him before. And he's like, no, hell no, yeah, Brody. I never thought he was like this. Are you no. doing opposite day on me today? No, actually, I, I would jump off a plane. Why not? Fuck, it sounds like fucking. Why not? You got to do that. You got to I do think that. he's fucking trolling. It sounds like a vlog. Today, bro. I think I, I, I'm going to be honest. I think he's fucking <laughs> with us. I, I mean, honestly, I mean, seriously, you got to, bro. What, what the fuck? Have what you ever else? done any extreme shit like this that we don't know about? Uh no, I mean shit. I mean, well, I jumped in the in the, you know in, been in the ocean and shit like that. Yeah, I've done that. That's fucking. I've never been afraid it's not of extreme, that. Extreme, man. But I mean, well, I mean, because you said, jumped out of a, a airplane. Uh, I never jumped out Have of you bungee jumped? Bungee jump? Nope. Neither. Oh, do you I, go on those big ass rides that drop? <laughs> Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, you fuck do. Yeah, you yeah. fuck with that? Yeah. Oh yeah, coasters. I can't. Fuck I could with do roller coasters. I do mm. roller coasters all the time. He doesn't give a fuck. Yeah, yeah. yeah he yeah. don't care. He don't care about germs. He don't care about the ocean. Or the environment. <laughs> He's one with the fucking environment. Yeah. The environment. Yeah. I'm cool with the environment. I don't fuck with the environment. <laughs> <laughs> you mean you don't fuck with it or you like you don't do bad? Like you don't fuck with it. Like you don't step on ants. I don't kill bugs. I don't fuck with ants. Oh, can I tell you some shit that happened? Real quick. I was at my mom's and I looked down at the toilet and there's three ants walking by. And I was all, oh, get away. But I'm not going to kill them, kill bugs. And right when I was about to go, I stopped. There was an ant and another ant following it. And the ant in front of it was holding oh, its homie that was like busted in half. Oh. An ant was like broken. But you could see his legs moving. And he was holding him, carrying his ass off. <laughs> like some war movie shit. And I picked him up on a paper they towel and I put him homie. outside. I'm like, yo, you guys are taking your homie back to the fucking home. Oh, I probably should have <laughs> let him go. They'll make their way back. I just didn't want people to step on them. Yeah. But dude, it's like a war movie. God damn. It was <laughs> fucking insane, actually. Oof. Crazy, huh? <sighs> yeah, anyway. Mm -hmm. it's, a it's a world. It's a different world. Of bro. course. I've seen Bugs' life. I told you I saved a real. little lizard's life once, right? From a spider. That shit was tremendous. Oh, yeah. You can't eat around. You can't get it somewhere else, spider. Yeah, yeah. Fuck Sorry, that. bro. I wet the shit out of spiders. Fuck you, spider. Uh -huh. dude, Trying no, to eat they fools. gotta eat. I That's know they gotta even eat, eat, eat over there. Yeah, no, as long as you have a spider you, tattooed as, on you. As long as you don't you don't fuck with it, it's cool. Do you have a spider tattooed on you it. or no? That's their world. Huh? Do you have a tattoo spider? Double elbows? No. Elbows <laughs> up. <laughs> side to side. El elbows up. When I met him, that's what was playing. When I met him, he was doing this. And he walked up to me and he was <laughs> el elbows up. It's Lean Like a Cholo song, Marty. I don't know if you know that one. Yeah, no, no, I don't, I don't know. I have a. I have a dragon and I have a... Octopus. Oh, that is a dragon, huh? I have a dragon on this He side. has my name, too. My middle did you, name. Did you see the new Avatar? Actually, no, I haven't. I've been, I've been wanting to see it, but fuck, I haven't been... Make sure you got fucking like three hours, hours, four yeah. hours. Make sure bro. you got ten hours. Yeah, that's why, that's why <laughs> I haven't watched it, because fuck, what, what, what I don't want to like, spoiler it, but it could have been about fucking half of what it was. Yeah. El elbows up. They didn't enter the water until two hours in that bitch. Oh, shit, really? <laughs> I was, I was offended how fucking long it was. Like, you're, I do not need to be here this I fucking long. I was offended long. by how long it was. It was the best thing you could have said. <laughs> oh, I'm yeah, offended about, that you made yeah, me was, sit here. Was, yeah, <laughs> when I heard about fucking how long was I was actually going to go watch it. And then when I found out how long it was, I was like, ah, uh, maybe not. Like, Yo, like, I just want to hours, point it out real quick. It's a little too much. We all just started talking this episode. Good job. We didn't sit here and go like, all right, so these stories and that story. We just kind of let it go. Yeah. This is a good one. And this fool's not sitting here all nervous because we're not questioning him. No, he's a vet. This no. is better. This is your fourth time on here? Is it? I don't know. I want to say fourth. So this fool doesn't watch any of his episodes. He does. I, I have to tell him on our most popular episodes, he, he has two or three yeah, in the top he's ten. He's the most returning guest of all time. 
I don't, I and he don't even watch him, <laughs> little jerk. I'm not no one special. He's I'm girl. not no one special. At least, uh, <laughs> as he as he <laughs> levitates, <laughs> <laughs> I'm not no one special. Man. Walks on water. It's just I'm just me being me. Turns this back into a teleports. Full joint. Yeah. <laughs> oh, teleports over there. Refreshes our camera. <laughs> fucking charges it up. I ain't nobody special, man. Touches it and charges. <laughs> it edits our whole podcast. That's you. I like your Grove Street hat. Yeah, it is. I like it. All right, last yes. one. This is a new one. Last one. Go. Where are you at with things that you need to fall asleep? Oh, this is a new one. What is this? Like, I need a fan. I need a certain pillow or my neck's all fucked up. Is there anything that you need to do every night in order to fall asleep or not have shitty sleep? Mm, let's fall asleep on the floor on the lawn. <laughs> face down. Uh, um, just fuck. What else, bro? I think it's the fucking phone, bro, basically. You like, need your phone to sleep? No. I mean, what I'll do is I'll just go through my phone, uh, put some fucking... Um, some music on what kind of on. music do you fall asleep to? I gotta know right now. Classical music. Classicals? Oh, you get uh, smart in your sleep? Stuff, just all kinds of shit. Yeah, I actually wake up a lot smarter. <laughs> 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 Dude, next day I'm ready to fucking build a bomb or something. Build a bomb! <laughs> Yo, this fool don't care about hygiene. He only cares about blowing shit up. So do you fall asleep? <laughs> do, you have, do you have a routine or do you like pass out on the couch? Or do you like... Uh, you know what? Since I smoke a lot of OG all day long, usually, you know, I'll just fucking crash out. You know, I'll have a crash fucking, you know, wherever, say, fucking my living room. If I'm watching TV, I crash out. You Bathroom know? floor. Maybe Type about, shit. shit, I could watch maybe about a half hour, 45 minutes of something, and then I'll crash out. Mm -hmm. If I've been up to the whole day. You know what I mean? <coughs> and that's basically, fuck, at the end of the night, that's when I only get to watch maybe a little bit of TV. And, and that's not even TV. That's fucking just me putting on a... A movie or something because mm -hmm. I don't even got no TV in my house. It's two a.m. late. You, to you? you don't have a TV at your house. <laughs> I didn't know I have a TV. Food, oh, but okay, I don't bro, have. What? I don't. I don't have a it's big table. table. I don't have the channels. From, yeah. I don't watch television. Oh right. hell no, no. For you sure. have Netflix and shit though. Yeah, just uh, yeah. Sure. Yeah, I know. Do you watch some of the same shows mm -hmm. <laughs> right away or some shit like? That. You stay up late though. It's two a.m. late, or are you on passed the week, out? On, only on on my days off, I could stay up late. Maybe two o'clock. Sometimes three. You know, on a depends on, on his shit face. If shit face, it's on a day that where I'm fucking, you know, <laughs> just overthinking mm -hmm. shit and just uh, I have like all kinds of other shit on my head. I don't go to sleep maybe till like four. Damn. I want to get like maybe four hours maybe at the most. Like, I can't function on four hours. Yeah. Hey, you turn that mic towards yourself. Four hours maybe. Um, be, no, not lower, away from you. Four hours. Thank you. Fucking. That's the that's worst. That's like the least. Some now there's times where fuck I only sleep two hours. Fucking and bad. go and do a day? Yeah. God damn. Yeah, You're and then still bad. come home and shit you not, bro, that I fucking still can't sleep till fucking oh, fucking no. three in the morning again, bro. Because you're, like, too tired? Because my fucking mind is just going, bro. Just fucking, it's weird. I don't know. That sounds weird. That's I'm how I felt about, last night. I was too I'm just tired. thinking about exactly. everything, bro. Everything, bro. Everything. Everything and everybody, bro. You'd be surprised. Mm -hmm. He doesn't smoke the bongs no more. He used to. He needs to smoke more bongs. He's sitting there puffing a joint every eight seconds between Call of Duty. How's he going to go to sleep? Mm. You're sitting there playing games for an hour, and then your mind's supposed You're to right. go to bed. You're right. Maybe You're sitting yeah, there. I, could, I could fucking, you know, you fuck with it. No, nah, and this shit I could take. I could, like I said, I could take a little rice grain of artist so and I could knock the, Rip fuck the bong. Out. Rip the but, bong. I mean, my thing is, uh, no, sometimes I just got thinking to do. Mm -hmm. Man, I gotta <laughs> fucking, you know, yeah, bro. You so know what I mean? just got uh -huh. thinking to do, you know, okay. yeah, yeah, bro, yeah, yeah. Just, I know what you mean. Just, is it effective or is it time <laughs> yeah. wasting? Just no, like no, of course, it, it leads to something else the next mm -hmm. day, you know what I mean? It always leads to something. Oh, you you gotta get something out jogs. of it, bro, because if I would see it, nah, now, fuck that. Because, like, April will sit there and watch these murder mysteries and shit and all night and just focus your <laughs> mind on that. And I'm like, you're not getting anything out of this other than fucking scared. I had to stop randomly, my list. I stopped scrolling. This whole week, I didn't look at anything. Yeah. And you're doing the TED Talk shit. Fuck. Yeah. So I, had, I, dude, I had like 75 messages from two days. I didn't fucking check one of them. Mm. It, it really required, a, to try to memorize something, shit like that requires a true lockout. Oh, fuck with that shit. Yeah, I, I try to stay do, off My of brain it. doesn't. Yeah. I, next time we need a podium and we just need to be able to read it and just, if, if it's going to be written out like that for sure. It was so long. Yeah. It was too much. For my, we did it. 
But it was too much to do it again? Oh, you oh, want me to do God. it again? Yeah, no way. No, Can't was, do it again. It was great to do it. Yeah. No, I think what you got to do is now, just just now, just write your own no- notes down right now as you're going. And as soon as you're practicing all that every day, shit, your, net, your next TED Talk could be fucking in a year from now. But you got all this shit that you just yeah. been memorizing and practicing, working, oh, on, so working on and working on. Yeah, and, totally. and that's your fucking talk, bro. This, and that's how you kill it. Well, this is what happened, dude. Because I think it was behind too... Behind the scenes, this is what happened. Too quick. Yeah. We wrote our whole speech. Two days of four TED Talk. Marty took the TED Talk master class. And then we both watched and realized we are rewriting <laughs> our entire fucking speech. <laughs> the things we were putting in our speech, they say, the two things please don't do in your speech. This and this. And we went, oh, that's kind of a strong point I was leading on. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> So we wrote, he rewrote our entire shit basically with just chunks of our stuff and replaced it. Our, we re, had to redo an entire speech on Wednesday. Oh, shit. We had Thursday. seven note cards each of full, full fucking, fucking text. Text blocks. Trying to remember it all, but not even that. We only had 48 hours. Yeah. We had it done. Saw them like, oh, let's take the master class. See what they got to say. And he calls me like, <laughs> watch it. Call me back. I'm like, oh, shit. Because I think we need to reevaluate our whole speech. And like, fuck, you're right. So that's why we were panicking. We we, we didn't did procrastinate. It, we did it. We realized yeah. we needed to up it, make it better mm-hmm. to fit the topic yeah. better. Yeah, we, Dude, we had a whole yeah. other speech. I still got the old speech. It's fucking yeah. easy for me because it's a story time essentially. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, and I'm fucking listening <laughs> yeah. and do, going through my own brain. Mm-hmm. Then we rewrote it. That's why mm-hmm. we were stressed out the whole fucking time. Yeah, that's so why I was pacing for two hours just. It's a little confusing. Like the purpose of a TED talk is to express one clean idea that is uniquely within you to place that idea. You would like this and how they do it in the animation. They're like, they're like an idea is a specific group of neural paths. Like, and they like animate a specific little group of neural paths. And when you impart that idea on an audience, now that neural path formation is now in their brains than it wasn't before yeah yeah you like plant the seed yes yeah. and yes. that's the point of a ted talk one clean idea ideas we're sharing within the theme of that evening Ooh, yeah. it's, it was because <laughs> as we did it we weren't doing both pieces it's like oh we did the th- idea but it doesn't correlate with the theme directly you needed a through line you need to take a through line and that what i loved about what they said in the master class was think about yourself as a tour guide around this idea yeah so like how can we guide we're you guiding you around brain. this idea and bringing you back with a through line our through line was the hustler why because the hustler was the core this, of this, the theme this, this being able to start from scratch in this age what matters what qualities and then it just so happened we're both some hustling ass motherfuckers our whole life, so I was able to take our took our lives and wove it within the theme. It worked out. Yeah, it did. Yo. It did. It actually did. Yeah. 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 Thursday cool. night, I told Ralph, I was like, "Yo, I feel like I'm on a school project, and I got teamed up with the smart kid in class." <laughs> this motherfucker weaved our words. He, he took my words and just placed them in different parts, and went, "Oh hell yeah!" We needed to make it way yeah. more cohesive this way, and then we had to rewrite. Honestly, ninety percent of the speech was changed. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, within the 48 hours of going on with that motherfucker. Dude, we had two months. <laughs> we had two months to do it. We've just been... And we pulled... We've been so busy. We're like a week out. We're going, dude, we got to really focus on knocking out exactly what we want to say. This video, this episode, this video, this yeah, episode. Fuck this, 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 now, this, this, this. Can you imagine if oh. two months ago you guys, you would have just been catching yeah. all those points and catching all those points? Yeah, mm-hmm. of course. Fucking, oh. You would have just fucking yeah. killed it. Of it would have been like how people have their comedy routine memorized and yes. go out there and just yes. do it. That's yeah. what you got to do. So from this point on, that's how you guys just got to do it mm-hmm. right now. Just start taking those points and start putting them putting them down because on the next one, bam, yeah. you just fucking... No, we, for sure. We shit. could do that same speech again. That's a great fucking... Oh, like, for sure. Never that's even ours, that. bro. That's yeah. our shit. Yeah. And you guys, well, the I thing is, that, even yeah. the president of the United States gets a podium with his speech Notes, in front yeah. of him. Because... Valedictorians yeah. 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 get their speech. It's about the oh, ideas. Yeah, yeah. You don't want to be like... Losing the good points of the idea because of the like performance aspects of it. You know yes. I mean? Yeah. So we went out there with nothing. So we're like, uh, uh. and then just real quick, real quick, the light guy quit mid TED talk because something happened. So they had somebody else do it, and they had it so bright I couldn't think or see. So I want to point that out there. So if you see yeah, the TED talk, you see me doing this. There were some elements. Woo! Woo! She's all turning away we from the light. We couldn't really like, see our oh, was the shit. other thing. Yeah. yeah you, you couldn't really see anything. 
Yeah, it was so for a first was show. Pretty like, bright on. Yeah. Yo, it was like putting your eye up to your fucking headlight. <laughs> like when the optometrist does the yeah, when they do the <laughs> and look in your eye. That's how I. Felt. I was thinking about that when I seen. I was like, "Fuck, bro, look how they feel." You know, yeah, fucking, like, it would have been better eye. above us. They should. Not even that. Just next like, time. like a like twenty percent less would have yeah. not so like. Uh-huh. When I went up there first and went, so that's adjusted an old like one. whoa. Yeah, it was an old school ass theater. That's super old theater. They might have that for the people that fucking they. You know that they get fucking stage fright. And shit. That's what I was thinking because so, with can't that light, see, oh, you don't see nobody. Yeah. So you I get that. See nobody. It's like you just honestly. I would rather saw the audience. Yeah, I want to see people's faces. I want to point at motherfuckers. Want to say some shit. I wasn't scared to look at everybody. In Hell the no! Face. I wanted yeah. to look at fools. I in wanted the to. Face. It was a home crowd in there. Like yeah. Yeah. it was our fucking fans and friends. It was way. Yeah. It wasn't a cold crowd at all. No, nah, it was awesome. Um, <laughs> all right, so this fool can sleep on the ground. Basically, is okay. what he's saying. Frank Gallagher, he can sleep right on the ground. <laughs> <laughs> right? Why not? The top, no, the question. You're like, well, just go to sleep. And you're like, I sleep two hours. And then we talked about fucking video games and bullshit forever. Oh, yeah. Hey, Rant City. Right. I like it. That concludes where you at. That's over, under, done with where you at. Oh, that was supposed to be a Griselda drop. Oh, that wasn't a Griselda drop. <laughs> so you don't have your headphones on. You don't like to participate in our games. Um, he had a super sick sound lined up, and it wasn't that one. It scared the fuck out of me. It happens. It happens sometimes. It happens from time to time. Gunshots might go off, <laughs> but you know, it's your time. To, time to go. Don't duck, <laughs> fucking guy. It's your time. That's your time. No, no fuck man. That. That no, shit. I've dodged my fucking shit. Yeah, you did thirty he, some bullets in my life. He pulled fucking shit. The mask, Jim Carrey. <laughs> wow, wow, wow. That's him. I mean, shit. Always trying oh, to yeah. shit. You had a mask one loaded up. He just pulled a Jim Carrey the mask sound out. I wish you had headphones on. Oh, and you right, were too cool to put headphones on. No, I'm just saying uh, I don't need uh, them. I can hear what you. You can't hear any of that stuff. It's the there. Jim Carrey while changing the camera. While changing so the go. camera while talking about Jim Carrey. <laughs> let's just say we fucking crush that right now. Oh, god damn, damn it. it! Damn it, Marty! <laughs> Why right after we praise you? It's okay. There All right. it is. All right. Hey, hey yo. yo. You don't know what's going on. OG just left out. <laughs> like, these fools are fucking no, weird. Just inside like jokes. You guys, I know. I, 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 I bet Fuck. I you want a fig, dude? He'll laugh when he watches it back. You want a fig, dude? Why did it do? Oh, it hit the crease. I was like, why did it slide across the fucking table? These things are like, it's so crisp and fresh. God Fresh, damn. crisp. Boom, boom, boom. Look at OG. Oh, yeah, yeah okay. See. Well, thank you. So you got to let me see. Pass that move. I'm seeing. Hmm. <sighs> Ready? Hit that! Got right here. Yeah. Shout out the hash house. It's an empty box. You want to hit the pen? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love fucking with this. Oh, we got so the glue much. on deck. Yeah, that grill glue is strong. Look at OG puffing it, puffing it. Not even really hit. Oh, there he goes. There he goes. If Dana White can make a slap league, and we yo, could... stop! Oh, I thought you were gonna say something. No, else. no, that's just ironic okay. that he's got his own slap okay. league going. See? <laughs> see, can I see that now? Can I see that <laughs> Guys, let's get out of here real quick. For everyone watching, I really hope I get this. Real quick. We Make never it done in that the jar. I am. Hold on. Hold on. Thank you. In the leg, Kobe. <laughs> Behind the back. That was pretty close. <laughs> it broke midair. You saw it? The nugs split in two pieces. Mm. Damn it. It's okay. Hey, how you feeling? Damn, you ripped that blueberry. I can smell it. Really? See, those little five milligrammers didn't do nothing. Got, uh, it was a, it was a brought out his yeah. fucking host. Yeah, it brought out your inner intellectual. <laughs> <laughs> no, it was good. This is the best episode we've done so far with you, man. You didn't get all clammed up. You didn't text me, Dad, man, like, can you usually ask me different questions, man? Texting you under the table during that? <laughs> yeah, man, remember that? <laughs> <laughs> no, this was a good one. We're not going to even mention your Instagram because you don't do anything. Um, OG has no social media presence. If you guys want to go see o- <laughs> social, s- OG, just go look at old videos I've done no, with you him. you want to follow me, I'm going to show you just fucking... Nothing? He's at you Shark Turds what? on Instagram. Shark Turds? Oh, I was like, what? <laughs> like I said, but I just post on my story. That's it. You know? I know, but... Boom, they boom, still boom, boom, boom. pictures get pictures now. They do everybody. Oh, like, once again, <laughs> 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 bitches get pictures. Once again, reported right away. It's like fuck. I don't even want to fucking. 
Uh, like I said, right now, I got pictures that are still there. Next week, I'll get a report for a picture that's been there for fucking two years ago and shit. Mm-hmm. Like, fuck. Stupid shit. Really? YouTube like, just age-restricted our Ryan Sickler episode, episode fucking two. I already appealed it, <laughs> and they appealed it, and the first Josh Wolf one. What the fuck? It was it's two been years two ago. years. <laughs> get out of here. Boom, boom, boom. And the Brian Callen episode, age-restricted. Oh. Oh, well, is that right? They're restricted right now? Yeah, a bunch of our comedian episodes. Oh, oh shit. Restricted. Years old and shit. Yeah, two yeah, year like old I said, episodes. You know, like I said, somebody just actually takes the time and bam. And but now with the stories. Them. With the stories, I put, some shit, yeah, you could. Because you know what? My last, uh, one of my other accounts, the one I had first, that one got fucking deleted. Just fucking, for me, posting a fucking Raider logo. Damn. Really, bro. That's all I fucking posted. Salty. And the next day, gone. Was Probably like, wasn't it. Fuck? Maybe it wasn't that. I, you know what? Maybe it wasn't. But it was. Did you call that guy a bitch? No, DM. I think it was. Uh, you know, I think I commented on the World Star too. Oh, you probably said something super oh, hateful. Yeah. And I think and I got like 1,900 likes or 1,800 yeah, likes all the on a comment. <laughs> what I said. Agreed with him. <laughs> or whatever they're called. And I think it might. Have either, but that was, a, that was like a day before that. I remember that was like on a Friday I did that. And then by, by Sunday night after the Raider game, it was just bam, gone. God damn. Like, fuck. I all I did was post the Raider logo with a hateful caption. Somebody could DM you some <laughs> actual horrible shit and then you report it to Instagram and they, they don't do nothing. dick about it. No, no. no people no. threaten to kill Because the guy who the sees it, he just fucking laughs at it and says, you know, fucking big <laughs> fuck deal. Fuck them. Yeah. yeah. Big deal. Boom, boom, boom. Well, if you want to go look at a stagnant ass page that does not post shit, Go follow OG's you Instagram. Mean, shit. You'll see some here. shit. Here, it's, it's floating me. right here. What is it? OG You'll see Kush some real shit. Seventy six. What is it? At OG Kush seventy six underscore. underscore. All right. If you like that shot of the East LA sign, yeah. If you like that <laughs> same story of him East LA <laughs> wine <laughs> clinking, maybe a grow with uh, a boomerang. Um, if you go follow OG because he doesn't want to do anything else for us. No, you know what? Why don't make it? You guys tell me what you guys want to post. If I get so much, we want know, fitness push ups videos, oh, time reels, and the fucking growth. We, want, what? we want Joey Diaz motivational morning shit. We want you coming yeah. out. Hey, weasel tits, wake up! Fucking hitting burpees. <laughs> exactly. Up. Yes. So this, yeah. Whatever you want to yeah. do with your life. <laughs> Fuck it. Oh. That's what we want. And I want you to start break dancing again. Yeah. TikTok. Bro, you'd blow the fuck. You would up fucking start. blow up. Come on. Come on, your cousin fucking dog faces got arrested. You, it's your time <laughs> to <laughs> shine. Did they arrest that fool for some pot too? Or? It was for weed. <laughs> I have no idea. That's sad. That's some bullshit. Um, so yeah, all right, fun episode, man. It's one of the last episodes. It was the last episode you'll ever it's do the in the last studio. OG oh shit, Where we're moving to the new studio down. soon. Whoa, that's it. That's weird. We've hit three different I'm sets. Ready. I'm not even nervous anymore. After that TED Talk, it's kind Oh, of yeah, nothing nothing yeah. matters anymore. That shit was the most <laughs> nerve-wracking shit of all time. Anything. Fucking sit Oprah's ass across the street. I'm like, Yo, what's up, Oprah? Remember when you used to fucking uh, interview clan members when you first started? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. no, we didn't forget. Get <laughs> yeah. all upstanding now. No, she's tight, though. She's hella sick, actually. But don't be forget. We didn't forget. That's like... I remember somebody commented. I posted like 40 pack one time on Instagram when I first started and me laying in like a 40 pack, like a chair. Mm-hmm. And somebody wrote, one day when you're in your 40s or 50s, you're going to really regret this photo. And I went, unless I'm a politician, I don't think it matters. And then I thought, I'm going to remember this comment forever. Mm. Yeah, I did. Mm. Yeah, I don't regret it. Why where the fuck no. would I? It was pic- it's a fucking billboard, bitch. You think yeah. I give a fuck? I was me getting high on it. Uh-huh. Yeah, right? Still remembered it. Was, yeah. <laughs> this is what got you where you're at. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Was it for all those packs and shit? Yeah, what the fuck? Mm-hmm. I don't know. I just thought it was weird. Like, you're going to regret this one day. I'm like, you're, you're wrong. It's like not an OnlyFans yeah. picture of my <laughs> shark butthole. <laughs> like, it's like, Jesus Christ. It's just so weird. Yeah, right? yeah I keep thinking it's full of do- do- dookieing out fucking gems. Uh-huh. That'd be sick. Look, this fool's not even listening. He's <laughs> completely <laughs> gone. Space the fuck out. And fucking gems kicked out. <laughs> they did. Did no, the shark hit you? Fucking, who knows? You know what? It was those. Who knows? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Mid sentence, he switched up his mind. <laughs> <laughs> nah, actually, uh, fuck. I don't know. Were they fucking 50 milligrams? Each of those. They're candies? 50. Really? Fuck. God yeah. damn. They're pretty um, strong. All right. Thanks for being here, man. Appreciate it. Did a good job this time. Did you get a good job? I already know, Daddy. Did a good job. 
Dad, did you just call me that in front of everybody? That was Daddy weird. Right you called me that. That was weird. It's, you know, Daddy, I do good. Did you hear that? Hey, all about the pauses and the commas, where you placed them is how you worded that. Yep. Everybody heard it. My son, you heard that. Right His son's at home. Everybody driving. I'm sorry. The dead silence is, I'm just staring at OG because he's like, so do you want me to say something? Or do I just sit here? <laughs> or he's just hitting the pen again. <laughs> it's okay. You don't don't, don't follow your fucking Instagram. Damn fucking shits do hit. Damn. That's what happened, huh? I, I noticed so. you started like. Yo, out of nowhere, my fucking <laughs> smile fucking went up. <laughs> fuck it. I just, just like, started what listening. <laughs> I just started yeah. listening to you guys. That's exactly what happened. Thank you, man. Thank you for being here. Thank you for coming here on such short notice. And uh, real quick, yesterday we asked OG, can we do 1230? He goes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, what about like 2 o'clock? <laughs> like, <just, laughs> 1230 is good. 1230 like is good. Yeah, 1232, <laughs> 2 o'clock. What the fuck? Is it 1230 or 2? Then he texts me at 2 in the morning. Hey, what about 1230? <laughs> yeah, 1230 is fine. I called him at 1150. He's like, what's up, man? No, I was doing something. Like, so you want to do later? <laughs> oh yeah I forgot to text you that shit I'm like nah that's cool what about like 3 o'clock perfect I call him back yeah 3 o'clock yeah 4 o'clock's man 3 4 o'clock's great I'm like how about 6 that's perfect he got here at 7 o'clock <laughs> call I called him, him at 6 10 <laughs> I looked outside it's like he should be pulled up I called him he has no fucking shirt on walking through his house yeah I said yeah you said 6 o'clock I'm like at 6 10 yeah I know <laughs> I'm leaving my house in three minutes. He got here at seven. He lives 15 minutes away. No matter what, you left 40 minutes later. I'm going to fucking throw this against the wall. I just did the math in my head. I think I just, I just woke up too. I do. Oh, sure. You <laughs> so went to sleep. What's happening? <laughs> so this this fucking day. Oh boy, last night I fucking, so we got fucking, um, Justin fucking pulls up. We, we, we pull up to the fucking oh, TED talk. The right? We're up on top. <laughs> And you know These we're like fucking full they don't even sell drinks there. They don't sell fucking shit there, bro. Fucking it's an old ass theater. Homie goes, you know what? I'm going to the liquor store. Fucking homeboy goes to the liquor store, comes back with a fucking bottle of fucking Chinese whiskey. <laughs> yeah, bro. Yeah, some Chinese whiskey. You know, that's some like Chinese editors uh -huh. and fucking said whiskey, some bullshit. And I was just like, what? I was like, fuck, bro. You could have bought anything else but fucking whiskey. Whiskey, fucking just with me. It, I haven't drank whiskey in about, I want to say, eight years. Mm. You know what I mean? Because the yeah. last time I drank whiskey was on a Christmas day and I fucked up Christmas. You did? <laughs> yeah. Eight years ago? Yeah. What, at your own house you fucked up Christmas? Yeah. What'd well, you do? Well, at my family's house. Well, yeah, what'd, you do? what'd you do? What'd you do? Tell me real quick fucking, before we get out of here. Come on. Uh, I want to hear this. Well, fucking, um, just, bro, just. Say it. Blacked out and fucking you knocked blacked it down out. to everybody to. Fucking, uh, I think it was okay. So it started with I sold it. I sold it so real quickly. So I sold a truck to one of my cousins and um, her to her husband, you know, he which he wasn't my he just found family by you know because he's with my cousin. So fucking, I sold my truck that I got for a hundred bucks literally a hundred. How dollars. on earth do you even get that weight of metal and rubber for a hundred dollars? It was just one of my cousins said, Hey, I have this truck in my fucking in my driveway. If you fucking want it, give me a hundred bucks and get it the fuck out of here, bro. Is inflation that bad? So no no, I'm telling you this in was back years. then. This was nothing uh -huh. this was still like about this was like eight about years eight years ago. ago. Yeah, so you know, so I, go, I went to his pad, my cousin not knowing that it, all he needed was a battery. <laughs> I took the truck, I'm like, yeah, I'll take it. I took the truck, went to fucking AutoZone, fucking bought a battery, put it in there. Truck started like nothing, put gas in it, and the truck was fucking running fine. <clears throat> I had a cousin that fucking was walking in foot with her, with her boyfriend. They had just had a kid and shit, so fucking he was just, you know, they were just walking. I'm mm -hmm. like, fuck it. I told him, you know what, bro? You want the truck? Fucking give me... Two hundred dollars, eh? Just give me a hundred bucks for my battery. What I paid, whatever my time. Give me two hundred bucks. Okay. Give me two hundred bucks. Dude sold the truck. Fucking the next day, <laughs> and I was fucking pissed. And then fucking, you know, we're fucking. Um, what a fucking asshole. He fucking, you know, we're right there. Shit. Next next day, I see him. Or I think it was Christmas, and that's when we run into each other. And. So I told me, bro, what, what kind of shit was that, bro? Like, I could have fucking sold that truck mm -hmm. for fucking two thousand dollars, but you know, I said, seen you guys walking, I give you that truck to go sell. You know what mm -hmm. I mean? And then this fool fucking tells me, oh, and he calls me the the, the, 
you know, he uses the N-word, you know. What? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what story took a fucking left and then a right fast as shit? <laughs> Sorry, continue, continue. <laughs> so, anyways, he calls me. He calls me. And he says, "Fucking, you know." Yeah. He calls me then. I'm like, "Bro, what the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, I'm a fucking, you know." What a left field shit. You know, you know what I mean? Because I was like, "Bro, what the fuck was that kind of answer, bro?" When I'm asking you about that, <laughs> and you fucking say that, you know, this was all like, you know, these guys all. I'm like, what? <laughs> Boom. You know what I mean? Mm. Fuck this, and we fucking, and next thing you know, I'm thank you for giving this. Marty something to bleep out, but keep going. <laughs> Well, Continue. Sorry. No, please. The whole party got fucked up. <laughs> so you turned you into were a rumble? Based? Yeah. That how, was did, how did that because ruin Christmas? That didn't ruin Christmas. Why? He ruined Christmas. No, because after that, bro, I mean, no, shit. He did that. That's his you fault. You couldn't fucking, yeah, just, I, I was just uncontrollable. Mm. It was just fucking, I got Wait. his ass. After they took me to the side, I already had, I just drank like fucking, I want to say, I want to say I drank the whole bottle of Bucanas. You know, mm. Bucanas? Fucking drank that whole shit and fucking. Fuck that dude up. Yeah. You know what I mean? And then he got there, and then I was like, well, bro, what fucking kind of shit was that, bro? What the fuck? Yeah, we're going to keep yeah, going into yeah. more bleep shit. But well, yeah, anyways, but yeah. Yeah. And fucking, and he said it like, uh, and when he said it, he like backed his head up like, you know, uh, like just like, uh, like, get the fuck out yeah, of here. Like, get the fuck out of here. Like, yeah. you know, but he said, you know, what the end when I was like, what what the fuck, bro? What kind of shit was that, bro? Like, you didn't even fucking give an explanation. So, bam, I just hit that mm -hmm. screw and bam, and next thing you know. I think any word he said, he deserved to get punched in the face. Uh, your mom's the best. Still fucking suck his ass. <laughs> yeah, you know, so after that, we just, it just started a big old commotion, you know, fucking rumbling. You know, we started fighting and shit. Did you win? And, um, well, it wasn't even, it just, we had too many family members involved. Mm -hmm. Everybody's You're in the fighting, middle. all the kids are so, there and shit, huh? You know what I mean? Yeah, it was like Christmas time. Hey, bro, I, we had, I had Christmas. just... I had, so I now you ruined... I get why well, you ruined Christmas, okay. I ruined okay. Christmas because all, all, all right. fucked up. Everyone's there. <laughs> fucking all, everything just fucking... Just uh -huh. a fucking chaos, you know what Dude, I mean? I didn't and raise my kids. Christmas right, was though. done and fucking... <laughs> I, didn't teach I knocked this. over shit over it. Fucking... Mm -hmm. Fuck out of here. The Grinch. That <laughs> green hat. Look at him. No, nah, actually, you know what? I don't remember all that. You know, I blacked out. That's That that was a time when I, I never had drank in whiskey before. That's why That's why we're back to whiskey. Wow. And fucking... God damn. And, and this is this is why I said I never fucked with whiskey no more till fucking yesterday. Damn, bro. your edibles fucking, make this full on point. You You're know? fucking talking about the whole thing from the subject? Hey, did you, this one went to TED Talk you yesterday. Was like, shit. You know yeah. what, man? I'm going to fucking talk like that. <laughs> damn, this was all fucking talking like professor and shit. And that is a turn why yeah. I do not no longer uh, yeah. establish a connection with whiskey. Like, Jesus <laughs> Christ. Well, anyways, that's it's what elegant. whiskey done to me fucking eight years ago. And I fucking said, you know, never again fuck whiskey, bro. Until mm -hmm. so last fucking, night it, it at a public in, event we were doing? To somebody else. <laughs> 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 fuck, fuck, fuck. <laughs> he just shows up to it on an important night of ours. <laughs> last time I fought somebody. <laughs> I'm going to drink here <laughs> 10 times. <laughs> fucking ass. <laughs> It's all right. It's all right. Uh, that's well, fucking funny. You know what I mean? And fucking so, <laughs> fuck whiskey. Food. Yeah. That's last the night, fucking this motherfucker gave me whiskey, and I was fucking. It just it got me fucking pretty mm. lit. Last night. Yo, all I'm gonna take away from this: full drinks teas. He's Becky. He does crystals. Not crystal. He has crystals. <laughs> he slips and slides down the uh, strip. He he belly slides down the strip. He has an octopus that means something. And what was the last thing we just talked about? Oh, he can't handle his liquor. I gets me wild. <laughs> Whiskey gets me wild. That's, so everything I'm hearing is like, I've heard other people say Fuck these things here, in different like tones. Yeah. Okay. And they were all like these white girls I knew. Like, oh, I, do, I have a certain friend. No, vodka. Oh, you want to fight? <laughs> you can't. Fuck, I don't know what it is that that alcohol makes me violent. Like, yeah. wow. Well, I mean, I said, I think there's a different high with vodka, tequila, and fucking It's whiskey, all the bro. same to me. No. I, I mean, I get, I don't understand. It's just because it doesn't affect me that way. So I'm like, yeah. why would it do that? Bring out violence. Yeah, why would it bring no, out no, violence? No, not bring out violence, but it no, just I'm brings out a whole different a whole different character out of you. Yeah, yeah. No, I'm saying some you people say, I mean? like, what I can't mean? drink that, I'll fight people. I can't drink this, I'll, yeah. I'll fucking they argue with my girlfriend, yeah. or oh, I'll be a dick on that. On a specific drink. Specific drink, drink. yeah. yeah I know a lot of people like, like oh, whiskey. No, yeah. I'll fight. This for like, oh, whiskey, I'll fucking ruin Christmas. Mm -hmm. Shit like that. I call April uh, 
like confrontational Connie. That's her alter ego. She oh slips into. <laughs> oh, when she drinks alcohol, she says, "Oh, yeah. oh fuck oh, it." No. <laughs> With people, shit, random people. She wants to talk to everybody, but she'll also like be very quick to fucking slide that energy into a fucking argument. Oh, slide no. that into fucking the stomp oh, yeah. out session. No, <laughs> <laughs> to a See? stomp out <laughs> session. There you have Yo, it. Yo, people. Got, you know what's scary? Being a girl, and and. Meeting people like April that you don't know. She looks so nice, all done up. Like, <laughs> that girl stomped that girl out in the fucking street. Pulled her fucking hair out and walked away. <laughs> That's scary as fuck. Because you see a dude like, ho, ho, ho. I don't want to fight that motherfucker. You see it. Yeah. Not all the time, but you can sense it. Yeah. Like, with girls, you're like, oh, no, she tied her Such hair up. mom. Oh, she took, she has cauliflower ears. Oh, Shit, she's gonna beat the fuck out of me. Like, you don't know what's gonna yeah. happen with girls because that doesn't happen often. Yeah, it's true. That's scary. That's point. It's the next TED talk. It's <laughs> the next TED talk. <laughs> Bitches be fighting. That's the next TED talk. Eddie Murphy's my co host besides Farty. Yeah, <laughs> He's gonna shit. come out and give his whole speech from Raw or Delirious. I mean, <laughs> I didn't, I'm going to Africa. We gotta, we gotta end this video. So I was about to do this whole fucking. African, I need to go to Africa and find a wife. Remember that uh, Eddie Murphy <laughs> shit? Eddie, <laughs> yo, yo, you get canceled for some shit like that today. Well, I don't yeah, give a bro. fuck. It's still funny as hell. Season Sorry, three, so Eddie Murphy. Season three, Eddie Murphy, for real. Come sit down. After this TED Talk Eddie shit, Murphy. I think I can sit down. Yeah. Still, Will Sasso scares me. Yeah, for sure. It's still hard yeah. to keep up with a man like that. Yeah. I don't know if I can even like, so, um, so <laughs> well, how do you wake up? What do you, how do you sleep? Like, no matter what you say, he's going to fucking mold it, kung shift fu it, it back like, in. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah, I bet he will. Well, oh, well, yeah, so there's a few people that do that. So anyway, we have to end this episode. OG doesn't post at all. Uh, we'll check everything out. Appreciate you guys so much. Uh, this is the first filmed episode of the year mm -hmm. yep thanks for being here yep. guys we got a couple big guests coming in we're yeah. back at it we're filming fucking three episodes in four days and we got yes. a dope as the videos multiple ones in longest the story time of all time coming out hour and a half oh, <sighs> got a fucking hour and a half story time <laughs> Woo, it's a full movie like full Damn. lake movie yeah um all right thanks for being here man you want to go to my house and get higher let's go all right let's uh, go actually, yeah yeah let's go yeah, you don't have a car, so you have to come with me. <laughs> Your wife is at my house with Rosie. So. All right, guys, thank you so much for being here. This has been the Dope as Usual podcast. This is my co-host, Marty O'Neill. This guys. is OG. Thank you, OG. thank you so much for being thank here. You thank you, everyone. Thank you for Jay and Rocco for yeah. just... Oh, and Tony. Tony showed up to... In-studio audience. In-studio audience. Oh, they're in the, they're yeah. silent. I didn't even know you guys were there. <laughs> they're, the, they're the best, most quiet audience <laughs> right? ever. Thank you guys so much for being here. This has been the Dope as Usual podcast. We're here, and we talked about life, drugs, problems accomplishments and everything in between have a dope ass day i am so high and just brain dead yeah, that I ted talk I feel for it. I, it was great it went great but wow my brain's brain mush space. dude yes. <laughs> whoa i couldn't even say accomplishments earlier to the agony i almost couldn't say eligibility remember that yeah. that was crazy good episode good job, fool guys. good fucking job